Ah oh, shit, I'm late. Hey, what's good, everyone? Hello, hello, hello. Um, yeah, you know, it's uh, it's that time of the month. Of the month, of the week, Jesus. It's not that time of the month yet. Uh, bo -bo -bo -bo. let me see here. We are pretty much all good to go. I just uh, need to do the last finishing touches on the bracket. Two last week without Eddie. That is uh, that's fair. That'd be right. It feels like you know I've been away for a week, and to me that feels like I haven't streamed in like a year. So I'm all rusty. No, I don't know if anyone can relate to that. But in any case, we're starting in four minutes. Um, so we need Marsh and Eater to check in. Uh, we need uh, Rhyme to check in. We need Bad Luck Charm to check in. We need Baku44 to check in. We need Pishu to check in. We need Fuyu to check in. We need Dillo to check in. We need Jalovi to check in. We need uh, Luigi to check in. Luigi, you're, you're here. I, I see you. So I'm just going to check you in. <laughs> and we need yourself to check in. Uh, so again, yourself, Jalovi, Dillo, Fuyu, Pishu. Dark Juste, uh, sorry, Dark Juste is checked in. Let me start again. Yourself, Jalovi, Dillo, Fuyo, Baku, Badlock Charm, Raimi, Martian Eater. You guys got three minutes to check in, or you will be DQ'd. Ashush, uh, you know the drill. Um, make sure that you have the same name on Discord that you have on Challenge. If you don't have the exact same name, that is fine. Just make sure that the name is at least similar enough that you can be found by your opponent. Um, that's pretty much it. If you need to change your name, actually, you can go here to your settings, where you can uh, incidentally also change your name to whichever uh, you think fits. And uh, if you need to DQ for whatever reason, there's this little unregister button here as well. Yeah, true. Ace never checks in on time. What, uh, I can't believe that guy. Oh, we got another sign up. Very nice. But yeah, we're starting in a couple minutes, guys. So, uh, you know, stay tuned as usual. That's how to do B. See some here. Okay. Yeah, if anyone uh, is Spanish tech support, that might be good. <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't, I don't speak Spanish, so I can't really help much. Uh, There's any confusion about how match rank was stuff like that. Definitely, if any experienced Spanish players can help out, that's very nice. Alright, so we are just waiting here. How have you guys been? It's been, uh, you know, it's been a week. I haven't uh, posted anything. I could say uh, for you guys that next month uh, I got something very exciting that we're going to start. Uh, I think you guys will, uh, I think, yeah, you know, if you're usually playing in Soldi, I think you will find it very interesting. I think people who don't usually play in Soldi will find it pretty interesting. Um, <laughs> card Game Weekly, uh, not quite. It would be awesome, though. I, I, I agree. But, um, but yeah, so we're going to announce it fairly soon. I just need to basically get off my ass and do some, um, you know, actual uh, <laughs> actual work, especially on like the the PR side. I need to create, uh, you know, PR things for it, uh, graphics, uh, maybe even a little trailer. Who knows? That could be kind of exciting, that kind of thing. Um, so yeah, uh, look out for that. Should be quite nice. Um, sure. Uh, if you are, let me let me just let me go to Discord here. Uh, that the easiest way, right? Um, how stuff works. Let me just go before I ping everyone that we start. Uh, if you are unsure about how matchmaking works, we have this little uh, thing called a help desk in here on our Discord server. You can use the Discord server. There's a pin in here. I'll also post it in a sec. Um, that just kind of explains how everything works. 
So if you're on stream, uh, I will contact you in here in stream matches. If you're off stream, you have to go to matchmaking, find your opponent. Um, if there's any issues, you should contact me in help desk. That's pretty much how it goes. Um, Valley symbol. Uh, everything is written down in there. Um, and speaking of, I just gotta, before we start, put a couple matches on the stream. Uh, obviously, already. Oh, somebody signed up for a second. Technical old decoder signed up. Nice. This decoder right around Skinny D. Is our output decoder one? Uh, yes, they are. They are very much allowed, just no item moves. So you can. Uh... Bro, somebody signed up last second again. <laughs> one second. Oh no, they didn't. Yeah, they did. It was Oliver. You go there. Congratulations. You are now conceded. Epic. Bro, somebody else signed up last. Please, guys. Oh, Molino. Molino's pretty good. Uh, Molino should go, like, I think here, probably. That's, that seems fair. All right. Yeah, otherwise, you know, thank you very much, Shadow Justy. Thank you very much uh, for the help. Speaking of, uh, well, I guess you got to play Andrean Street. So um, I'm marking a couple matches now, so we, uh, we're going to see who's going to be achieved. Let's do Dark Justy Andre, uh, Danish player. Let's do... I'm kind of interested in, uh, you know... Let's see, who should we do here? I kind of want to put all the match uh, 62. Oh yeah, that might be very good. True, true, true. Robber. We can do you. Um, if you're on stream, Shadow, uh, I will I will contact you, so don't worry about it. So you, you're pretty much good. You just have to to wait. Essentially, uh, let me see here. Let's do this. Could be good. I mean, you. I see. I got a message. Yes, I. Can. Wait, are you sure they message me? I don't have any messages. Um, yes, you get tagged in Discord if you are up, absolutely. Um, let's do these two middle ones here. Yeah, exactly. There we go. And I'm just marking everything so I remember to not forget to do it. And help us, Chrome. I'll, I'll, I'll have a check in a sec. Thank you for the hats up. Alright, we are pretty much good to go, it looks like. And there we go. I'll go into help desk. And. Oh, keep can't make it. Alright, fair enough. I'll DQ them real quick. TB. There we go. And key. Alright, what's good, everyone? It's uh, my face. And uh, let's try to get this technical out of here. I'm going to be with Haunts today. Um, also, what is good, my man? Hello, hello. Hello, hello. So How it's going to be an old Denmark affair. You know, I put all the Danes on stream. Uh, oh, I like that. I like that. That means I can root for someone. Exactly. So you, you'll be like, uh, well, we'll both probably be biased, but you know. It's, <laughs> it's going to be hard not to. Yeah, and it, it's the interesting part, right? I mean, Quabba we know, but uh, Andre is, uh, you know... Well, uh, you're going to be pinged for stream, uh, Justy, so don't don't worry. You'll, you'll be contacted by me, so you don't have to do anything. Uh, but yeah, it's going to be pretty fun. It's been, uh, you know, I was in Norway uh, this week. I, I cooked, actually. Okay, second you place cooked? in Oslo locals. Oh, wait. What? Wait, okay. Was there any names? Uh, the the guy I lost to twice uh, is called Ace. Do you know him? Uh, yeah, yeah, I do. He plays as a center, right? Uh, yes, he absolutely destroyed me. Yeah, two times. I think I met him in ranked, uh, like once, and I lost him as well. So you yeah. know, no shame. I, I won. I think a uh, one round in total. Oh, ah, okay, okay. Yeah, but like... he's, he he seems really good to be honest. Um, but I beat I beat Rob Master and I beat a uh, Mad Cow. 
Rob Master, he's playing. Uh, is he playing Shaheen now? I saw him play Shaheen during like the first week or so, but yeah, he's I mean, uh, Shaheen main now. Correct. Okay. Interesting. I mean, I guess that'll change when Bardag arrives at some point if he does arrive, but I assume he will. Yeah, um, he actually after we play like casuals for like an hour. And after that, he was like, man, maybe I should play Asuka. She seems fun. <laughs> <laughs> nice. I mean, Asuka does seem like a Rob Master character a little bit. She, she is very she fun. Does... I, I don't think she's, you know, and we talked about this before. I don't think she's necessarily that good, but I think she's very fun. But every, every character yeah. can kind of cook in this game anyway. Yeah, definitely. I mean, I feel like there's not really a bad character, so to say. It's just there. there's some that are better than others, for sure. All right, let me see how uh, it, it like. I don't know. I've been away for one week, and now I feel like I, I can barely not remember like how do I even make a lobby, you know? <laughs> it's so freaking weird. It's hard having dementia. Huh? It's being old, dude. It's... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know the feel. Uh, let's go in. So first up, we're going to have um, Dark Justy up against uh, André. André, uh, I usually know as a, um, a Dragon Ball player, actually. So that's kind of kind of interesting. OK. So one of these is from Denmark. I haven't heard the names before. Yeah, uh, André is from Denmark. I don't think I've seen them play uh, in any offline events. Might be wrong. I might be wrong, actually. OK. Well. I mean, if he's from Copenhagen, it would make sense, you know. Yeah, but definitely someone who uh, who signs up to Soldi quite a bit, and now for, for Tekken as well. I uh, see so he usually plays Dragon Ball, I assume, or maybe yeah. Guilty Gear, something like that. Bro, that, that is like ages ago, okay? Uh, that I got my hack rush. You're like, you're out of loop, man. <laughs> Wait, I can't. Oh. All right, pass goes. I assume they still didn't fix the spectating issues. Was there issues with the? Yeah. So the issue is that it will um, it will like have a uh, have a ton of issues if you put it on more than first to one, for whatever uh, reason. Yeah, I think I've experienced that before. Is that you know for some reason it doesn't let you spectate the second game sometimes. Yeah, exactly. Um, so we gotta have to. Well, we're doing Tekken World Tour rules anyway, so let's kind of have to go to. Yeah, I mean, if you want to switch stage and everything, it's better to just put it to first one, right? Yeah. People are like forced back to the lobby anyway. I mean. Oh yeah, yeah we we're doing the uh, we're doing the the regular rules absolutely. So let me screen share. I mean, um, you, you can tell me how the tag is pronounced. I'll try my best. Wait, what tag? You're talking to oh, me? Oh, somebody in, in chat. Yes. Get yeah, here get get EF. Oh that dude, that's too hard. I can't say it, yeah. Wait, wait. We already said that that last time I tried it was like gayer, gay as gay a fuck. Gay a gay. You know like gay or gay F? Yeah. <laughs> yeah 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 dude, I got it. I got it. <laughs> it's 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 hard to, hard to like especially because you don't know like the the certain pronunciation right like yeah yeah, yeah exactly like I mean, it's just the, gotta take the leap man I'm I'm certain I'm certain that you know the letters don't do it justice right I'll need to give me give me the what's it called again like the um oh, shit. The the phonetic alphabet, you know. Give me the give me the phonetics. I'll try, you know. <laughs> nice, nice, nice. Bro, Welsh is kind of cooked though. So what can you do? He's Welsh. I mean, yeah, it is. Dude, Welsh is like a population of a hundred people. What's the odds, man? 
actually my um it, it's like the weirdest relation but my cousin's dad is actually welsh that's crazy so you're like part-time uk person well not really right because it's not in in my side of the family say oh, but we do it. have uk people in the family yeah and he's like he, he speaks english like <laughs> and you're like yeah, yeah, yeah. huh yeah. gagif gagif yeah you could say Sounds that yeah like a uh, five beers yeah he's slurring like 10. Essentially, constantly sounds like that. Anyways, uh, it's going to be Justy up against uh, Andreas. We got the uh, the match. Let's see Raven and Junior. Girgaf. It was good to see Seku as well in chat. Who do you play Seku uh, in this game? Want to voicemail it? <laughs> Actually, that's kind of funny. Yeah. <laughs> So we're just waiting on both, but hopefully, you know, we can get in the lobby here. It's uh, taking a bit of time, I think. Yeah, I mean, maybe one of them, you know, has got to use the bathroom or, you know, smoke oh. a cigarette. Okay, okay. Maybe I'll, I'll just try. I actually thought they had to accept it. Yeah, you, you can play. You can play. You're good. I don't know where uh, Justy is, uh, is from. Uh, I mean, I've never heard the name. <clears throat> well, they they did speak Spanish, so uh, maybe I'll put a cheeky Spanish flag there. <laughs> I mean, I guess your odds are pretty good. Right. So Andre, we at least know Danish. Yes. And of course, the the anime player plays Jin, right? Uh, like. Yeah, of course. Get ready for He's the never next been battle. more anime. Except he doesn't play Jin, he plays Kazuya. Alright. Alright. He's saying like, Jin is my, is my highest ranked, but Kazuya, you know, that's, uh, yeah, that's, that's a real carry character. So uh, you, sh you should know. Oh shit, which button again? Oh, let's see. Bro, I hate that they added uh, randomly in the new patch. Out. Yo, Solid Snake! Yeah, dude, it's Snake. It's a cigar, except it's like a gold thing. Yeah, I guess that's a big uh, ball. That was like a little trick right there. From Justy. Justy? Yeah, Justy, yeah, I guess. Nice block, no punish! Not nice, though. Unlucky. I don't know what that is. Can the sweep? Yeah, I'll sweep. And one, two, nice. Get the extension from the heat. Second hit catches him. Walks into the heat smash, even though the first hit whiffed. Good punish. Yeah, very nice. Oh, drops a combo. That could have been huge, but nothing. Another drop, but slightly, you know, less of a drop. <laughs> we go electric. Mind. No punish at the while spending one. Okay. Dude, this game is so fast. <laughs> yeah, don't worry about it. The... There we go, one to one. Very nice. Mm. Like two. Okay, we're getting four for three in heat. That's the another health sweep. Another one. Good punish. Didn't confirm the one one. Okay, that's the string. Another string. Oh, nice punish and takes the round. Yeah, and uh, Andre, one away. <laughs> Dude, that amount of health sweeps. I love this. Hell sleep, man. It's, this is exactly how you play. <laughs> okay, Half Life gone. Justy. That hurts. Oh, get off. Oh, good anti air. Good 
good rage out interrupts the string. Uh oh, look at the life. Not a lot of life left here. Yeah, it's pretty much one launch from Andre. Breaks the throw. Not over yet. The second head. He was ducking, but stood up too soon. Oh, apparently he's. Uh... There we go. Michelle did some researching. Apparently he's a uh, Dominican, but living in Belgium. Dominican oh, Republic, Dominican. Like... That's like in uh, Middle America. Middle America. Yeah, but lives in uh, lives in Belgium. Yeah. Whoa! Well. Whoa, that was crazy. <laughs> Yo, big what boss the... turned on the cheats, dude. You know the I nice speed hack. Five. Uh, only for like ten hours. Or something. All right, all right. Because you know it's exactly he he puts the uh you know the cigar in his mouth and suddenly time skip. Right, that's what we saw right there. It's canon in the game. I see. Canon. I guess right. somewhere along the way, Solid Snake learned how to do hell sweeps and you know electrics. It makes sense. Yeah, I mean, isn't he like a master of CQC? Exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, maybe CQC, maybe they misspelled it. It's CDC, crouch test cancel, you know? <laughs> I mean, they didn't have, either have to, you know, only spell it wrong. It was also yeah, like, you know, voiced it wrong, etc. everything. I think, Sasha, I think it's just your PC blowing up. <laughs> I hope it wasn't the stream <laughs> lagging. Oh, man. All right. So we're going to go nice to Paris here. Yeah, I like the Vegeta. Yeah, it's cool. Yo, the Batman. You know, we're going back to our roots here, playing some uh, Dragon Ball. Oh, the FF4, yes. Okay, just in a bit of trouble here. Nice getting that counter hit, yo, into the electric. Oh, combo drop. The combo. They haven't worked since the CNT. <laughs> Unfortunately. Keeps going for the electric after. Uh oh, the stream is blowing up. I hate to see that. Jab. Good patience from Justy. Oh! Ray chart. Yeah, the Ray shot. That's very nice. Yeah, so health should be about even. Ooh. On two, no. That's safe now. Go. One a good round parry. piece. Good punish. Get a hell sweep. Oh, the string. <laughs> Just, uh, you know, doing some wave and stuff. Let me know if it's uh if, if it's better now, chat. By the way, I think I accidentally had a um, I, I, Steam was installing a game in the background. Worry about it. That's what happens, man. I don't know how it was installing, dude. Even right, I canceled the download, but it was installing. <laughs> it should look better now, surely, right? I mean, maybe it's like an know. auto update or something, you know? Yeah. Oh man. Good punish. <clears throat> yeah, definitely knows, you know, uh, all the... Yeah, I think that's you, too, but... Alright, oh, that string keeps getting him. Unlucky. No. He doesn't do the follow-up in heat. Maybe he wants to save it or something. <clears throat> Another Rage Art, though. Uh, maybe it's Twitch servers that's uh, messing up. Not gonna lie, like... It says no drop frames or any issues on OBS.
I wonder if it's a Twitch thing. Because, yeah, mine is freezing as well. Ooh. On one, two! I don't know, I mean, if it has other things today, I wouldn't mind. But maybe somebody in chat can report. On two again! Ooh! Nice back dash, okay. it's a hell sweep. Oh, I get some heat. That's the follow up, nice. Good punish on the whiff. Oh shit, it's happening again. Yep, that's a clap. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Interesting. Let me see. Don't. Oh, it's. Weird, I don't think there's anything to show anything on OBS that there's many issues uh, at all. I wonder if it's um if it's a uh, channel wide thing, like it's just me or um oh, yeah, I already want the Belgian flag. It like pixelates sometimes, it looks weird. Yeah. Another stream didn't buffer. Fuck me. Weird. Alright, let me uh let me see if I can fix so. it. Yep. Round one. Oh god. Uh, I wonder A was good Eddie. I wonder if it's something to do with the uh, new update. Update for 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 Tekken, that was like a weird thing when I launched it. I have no idea. I, I don't think it should matter though. I mean, when I'm looking through Discord, it's fine because you're screen sharing, right? That's There's true. no issues. Dude, Andre is in trouble here. Gets hit by the heat smash. I'm lucky. Yo, Eddie, what's good? What's good? this he's just getting rushed down right now the unblockable from the <laughs> what, what is it called backflips it's such a classic nice punish okay he's got to make a camp now unfortunately he didn't guess correctly yep and uh, Denmark Unfortunately, it takes the L. It's it. Yeah. Yeah, maybe if Barca is, uh, is downloading games, true. I don't think so, no. <laughs> also, our internet is so good that it shouldn't be an issue. Realistically, I should be able to download games and nothing should be happening. Yeah, I mean, streaming doesn't even... I mean, it doesn't even use the same bandwidth, right? Yeah. Because streaming uploads. Uh, okay. yeah, I already uh, reported it, Shadow, so no worries. Yeah, we, we just do it. Uh, if it's on stream, I just do it. Uh, if it's not on stream, um, no, I, uh, I'll have someone else. Or, or the players will do it, essentially. Uh, But weird, I wonder if, uh, do I have, yeah, my game is in, no, it is a, it is a stream specific thing. It doesn't have anything to do with the game if it's a stream blowing up. That's hella weird though. We'll just, we'll uh, have a look for the next game. If it's still bad, I might need to change some settings around. Yeah, 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 exactly. Uh, I didn't update OBS, so in case it does, like, does it have any issues when I'm just speaking? It doesn't, right? I wonder. Also, yeah, so it's just you know when it's your second, I guess. Yeah. But only on only on Twitch. 
It's just weird. That doesn't really make a lot of sense, does it? <laughs> I haven't had a buffer for a while now. Maybe it's just good now. Maybe she's good, you know? Yeah. <laughs> I Let's see. Let's see next match. It's like one of those mysteries. Yeah. We'll never know. So who we got next? I can see Quapper is joining the lobby. Yeah, got Quapper. Uh, yeah. Let me think. Justy is busy eating pasta. I can see from the chat. Yeah. I see. Yeah. So busy with the food, can't even quit the lobby. What the fuck, man? <laughs> also, uh, too bad Tibetano didn't show up, so uh, they'll be DQ'd, unfortunately. It's it. They even checked in. <laughs> it's like signed up and checked in, but didn't show up. So, yep. Oh, that's a last minute kind of thing. Yeah. So we've got both players in here. It's going to be Oscar against Quabber. Um, I forgot where Oscar is from. I Quabber, obviously Danish. Um, yep. You no, know, someone who was uh, both players were active during Tekken Seven. Really? Oh, uh, They've been playing in Salty before in Seven. Yep, yeah, both of them. Uh, Quabber as well been uh, offline in Aarhus. Uh, was there last time we had our monthly when I was there? Oh, I see, I see. Right. Like we are good to go. I think Oscar uh is from like Sweden or something. <laughs> it, it's like it's uh it's a Scandinavian country at least, a Nordic country. Get ready for the next well which exact country it is? It's a I'm not quite up. sure. You know, maybe we can get De Detective Farsai on the case for now. <laughs> there we go. Alright, let's see if the stream blows up. Let me know, chat. Yoshi versus Reyna. Yo, I don't think I've ever seen the hoodie up for Reyna, actually. Yeah, it's like a custom thing, I think. You have to equip it. Yeah, and instantly, you know, <laughs> yeah, lose the hoodie. There it goes. You know, it looks good while it lasted. Yep, there we go. Going to take a trip to the wall. Big, big combo. Wait, Oscar is Danish? Really? Are you sure? Well. Uh, let's do it. Double Denmark. I don't confirm the effort too. Right. Are you sure, Andre? The the Danish? They're not in the Danish server. Nice to down for two. That means we are taking that trip to war. You know, Yoshi has all these crazy moves, so it's like down for two is still the best one he's got. <laughs> yep. Nice! Getting the back turn as well there, and. Oh, that's the classic the mix. Situation. Back to the wall, Yoshi in heat. What are you gonna do, man? Gets the second hit. Bukini into uh, again the spin, doing a lot of work here for Quabba. That move is—he's getting a lot of mileage out of that move. Yeah, I mean it's he quite cheap, right? So. Yeah, I mean you gotta duck the second head, but there is a mix-up. So. Right, so Quabba takes the first game pretty fast, I gotta say. Yeah, just uh, you know, a little speed run here. They're too fast. I'll make it. <laughs> also, uh, chat, did the stream blow up during this game? No buffer? Okay, we good. So I guess it fixed itself. Easy. Get ready for the next I think it might have been that game that was installing. It was even... You know, 
put a little salt in the wound. It was um, it was even it was guilty gear <laughs> messing with Tekken. <laughs> yeah, I love the uh, Tekken three Yoshi. Even call it the uh, sword grain. Yeah, but I guess Oscar changed to Kazuya. Yep. Didn't feel the rain after that beat down. I mean, I I would understand. Yeah, I mean, Cassia Ride is a character you can enforce um, a lot of hard 50 50 mix, and uh, if you're struggling, yeah. maybe that's exactly what you need to do. Yeah, 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 just, you know, go ham with the mix ups. But I guess he doesn't really get the room for it at the moment. Probably kind of just having control of the match at the moment. It's just completely uh, kind of swallowing him with the, with the offense, right? It's, it's so hard. Oy! Especially this yeah. character, Yoshi. It's a very yeah, tricky dude. character. Uh, in Tekken 8. You hesitate to, you're so much uh, your buttons against him exactly because of the flash. Always gotta respect the flash. But... Oh. Gets the counter hit for cash flow. That's the combo though. One, two. Okay. Nah. Whiffs Hell's Feet yeah. from like full screen away. Yeah, it gets punished by the Heat Smash. Cool. Oh, damage. Doesn't matter. It nice. Just, the throw. Yeah, just a regular old throw, you know? Didn't yeah, hurt anyone. Or something, maybe. Okay. Oh no, that's minus 12. Good punish, though. Nice conversion, but doesn't really get a clean wall splat, unfortunately. We are at the wall, though. Breaks the throw. Yeah, but... Getting something at least with a good position, but now he's about to lose it. That's unfortunate. Good block, but doesn't punish. Kazuya can launch it. Minus 14 force crowd. Oh, no. Yeah. But Papa takes it. Yeah, 2-0. Very clean, and that means uh, Quabber is gonna fight against uh, let, Let's Hear Stream. It's too low, I can't can't hear it. Discord. Oh, I turned Discord. You got two buffer. Maybe, actually, maybe I know why. Like last time, I was adjusting sound as well in Windows, and maybe adjusting sound in Windows somehow kills the stream for a little bit. That okay. sounds weird, man. But, you know, I wouldn't be surprised. Yeah. This is just software working against you. Because I, right? I didn't do anything in the first match at all, which was fine. Yeah. All right, next up we got Ice Blue against uh, Skinny D. Skinny D, another um, veteran from the, uh, from the past. Ice Blue as well, I guess. One that I've seen around quite a bit um, in Soldi. I remember Skinny D playing um, Alisa in uh, in Tekken um... seven. <laughs> yeah, in, te in Tekken, uh, Tekken seven. Yeah, my, my brain, dude. It, I just uh, yeah, yeah, it's, it's it didn't cool. work no good anymore. You know. <laughs> Ba, ba, ba. Switch to Raven, okay. I mean, I respect that. Elisa's kind of, kind of wild in this game. I feel. Oh, it's like Garagayev. The the tag I see Garagayev. Garagayev. Yeah. I can say that. Garagayev. I would never. I would never have guessed. Maybe it's because I didn't update OBS for, for a little while. Who knows? We'll see. I mean, <laughs> check this match. If it still know. blows up, I'll change some settings around or something. Update OBS. I, mean, my, I was streaming yesterday, and my OBS is like super out of date, and it was fine. Yeah. I don't know. Mine is running on like 
like this version has been fine as well um i've streamed in this version multiple times no issues yeah i mean it just sounds like one of those weird things can't really explain yeah just you know technology being weird i'm still going with the with the sound thing because every time i i kind of mix messed with the sound it happened which yeah arguably still is very weird obviously uh, speaking of very weird is that we still have 40 codes left on match arena what's that all about chat come on 40 codes guys got 10 claimed um you know we're just a little bit off from getting to that 20 dollar spot which mean you know means top two will get paid which is quite nice you know we all love that so make sure that you go claim a code right now or else <laughs> So we are just waiting on Skinny D to join. I sent them an invite on Steam, so it shouldn't take too long. Do you not participate in your own tournaments anymore? Mm, there's too many players, unfortunately. Um, so I used to do it when we had like 20 players, maybe, because then it's viable. But it's not yeah. really viable with like 50 players. Um, yeah, I understand. I understand. Because the, first of all, you'd have to see all my matches on stream. Um, and then second of all, uh, you'd have to like, um, I'd, I'd have to do like the tech issues while playing. Um, yeah, yeah it's too much. Too it's much. too much. Yeah. That makes sense. But I, I would have liked your excuse to be that you don't like T8. Hmm. Because then we could agree about something. But I mean, I love T8. I, I like the game. I, I like the game actually. I'm scared. I know. I, I'm, I'm, yeah, go ahead. I've been playing uh, offline instead of going online. But I haven't. I honestly think, yeah. I honestly think that that's the way as well. I mean, I think what's messing with me the most about this game is the net code. Sometimes it just feels a little bit weird, you know. But I feel like when I play offline, it's 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 okay. Get ready for the next battle. Yeah. Yeah. I just um. I don't know. I think I, I think I just need to play more online as well. It's been busy, it feels like. Which, uh, shame. Anyways, here we go. Ice Blue against Skinny D. Skinny D on the Reyna, though, saying they swapped to Raven, but that's not Raven. That is definitely not Raven. But all right, against King in the classic. In the classic is it one suit. Or two? I don't remember. It's a uh, two. It's the King Spridge. Oh, that's he's dead as fuck, dude. Yeah, I saw uh, the new tech that you could uh, just simply hold a button to beat dead chain throws now, which is quite neat. That, that's such a good change. For some reason, the before, even if you mashed it, you would still miss the break sometimes, which was weird. Even though the correct, you know, it was the correct input, it's just yeah. timed correctly. But a good change. That's I'm still kind of you know popping off right now. Yeah, I mean, I'm still mashing. But I gotta just uh, just learn and just hold. Yeah, yeah, I don't yeah. trust the hold yet. You know what I mean? Like, okay. but here another chain throw. Can you guess correctly to get out? Oh, nice. Let's get out. Yeah. Okay, nice punish. And that is uh, Ice Blue now in a 2-0 lead here. Skinny D in a lot of trouble. Doesn't break the throw. Oh, it's still blowing up. God damn it. <laughs> yeah, that that hurts, man. King in this game, absolute beast of a character, I gotta say. Yeah. Uh King King is like the one character in this game that really grinds my gears, you know what I mean? Like I don't feel like it's the strongest necessarily. Yeah, it's just super game, annoying but... to fight. I mean, yeah, especially the the way they buff throws, right? Like, it just feels very rough playing against this character. Yeah, it's like a, in a lot of cases. I mean, they took a lot a lot of like fast counter hits out, like M fours and stuff. But yeah. what a lot of players do is they substitute the M four with a throw. Get but the difference here is that King throws stuff. us like like I don't know fifty sixty damage sometimes. Uh, so using those as like a counter hit tool is like super strong for him. On top of, you know, using the throws as like a, 
you know, mental stack, mind game, mix up tool, etc. It's just, it's, yeah. Okay. Nice hitting that electric. I'll take that trip to the something going here. Maybe changing up his plan a little bit. Doesn't that the. Oh, no. Ooh. A good break. Yeah, very nice. You need to break those, right? Does oh, not dude. break the giant swing. Is it gonna hit the ball? No. Oh, nice. He's still alive. There's a chance here. Finishes with the run slide. Actually, let me try one thing real quick. Start this. No, it wasn't low. Here. Oh. Goes for the hard combo, drops it, unfortunately. Good electric on the whip push. That's so hard to punish. Hey, what we doing? Jab, jab. At the wall. Oh no, gets the giant swing. Man, his input crushed his jab. That's so unfortunate. Nice. Yeah, that's skinny D around. finally. Put around yeah. on the board. That's the kind of hit. No pickup though. Good punish on the full crush D of two. Unfortunate, that's minus 13, I think, now. You're probably right. Man, just, <laughs> we're using one move Andy over here and it's working out. <laughs> is that a clock from KOF? I think it is, actually, the king outfit. That's nice. Uh, yeah, I mean, it might be. I mean, you wouldn't know. No. <laughs> Uncultured. <laughs> oh, no. Ugh. Solid damage. Another chain grab started. Okay, can you guess right? It's gonna be painful if it doesn't. Already is painful. It's very painful. Oh god. Oh no. <laughs> Jesus. Oh lord. Jesus Christ. Call an ambulance. <clears throat> that does it. That does it. Well played from Ice Alright, so, um, that is a quick 2 0, another one. Take it. And Skinny D will move down to the loosest side of things. And let me just rehear how this is pronounced because next up we are going to have. Garagayev, Garagayev up against uh, Schizophrenic69. Good fucking job on the pronunciation. Very nice. Thank you. <laughs> I think I should just say Gara. That's, that's easy. Yo, Gara from Naruto. <laughs> say that, Gara. I haven't watched Naruto, but I know who Gara is. It's the one with the, it's the guy with the sand stuff, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's funny that uh, this guy played like Schizophrenic 69 plays fucking Yoshi as well. <laughs> <laughs> Something funny about that. But really strong player though. Um, both of these players are someone who uh, usually, you know, um, Gara uh, made it to top 8 last week. Um, and uh, Schizophrenic oh, really? has been making it to top 8 multiple times now. Okay. Okay, very, I mean, very nice. that shows some consistency. You can make it multiple times to top 8, right? Yeah. It was good, Fruity. Hello, hello. Ba, ba, ba. <clears throat> and it also means we are moving into our top 32. Interesting. Yeah, it's a former champion of Denmark next to me. If you didn't know, chat. 
<laughs> this, this guy is a Please, national I like, champion. Dude, I should have made a criteria for me being here today. Jesus. I mean, every, it's... every day I go, I get reminded. And yeah. now I'm just super washed. Yeah, you won and then you lost, you know. Now. <laughs> yeah, I've been losing ever since. It was good while it lasted for that one, you know. Yeah, was it like... the COVID years even, you know? So you basically. It was. I mean, I've never played well offline. That entire championship thingy, that was just online, all of it. <clears throat> so so he's like the the online hero of denmark is it <laughs> which is you know it's still something uh, uh, yeah i guess it is get ready for the next battle all right so we yoshi versus dragonov yeah, Drakenov uh, getting some hefty nerfs, I saw. In the recent patch? Yeah, right. I didn't even see that he got nerfed. I think, so I just saw um, Gara actually send, like, uh, just a list of things and said, like, damn, you know, Dragonov getting hit. I didn't even read what it said. I just trusted <laughs> that it was nerfs. <laughs> I mean, he, he should get nerfed yeah. a little bit. It's just, you know. One of the main problems with Dragonov for me is that if you don't guess correctly, you don't get out, you know? Yeah. Otherwise, it's just his turn forever. Oh, so like the character you play. Wait. Come forward to connecting. Taking a trip to the wall here. Never mind. I think it's the thought break. It's the wall spot, full combo. And I love this Yoshi custom. It's a. Uh... Yeah, it's clean as a fuck looking. Oh, gets hit by the butt. Unfortunate. When he's in flea stance, his hitbox is like super huge on his butt right there. It's kind of weird. Uh, Jacob is saying no real nerfs. Damn. Hit it. Hit it here. Yeah, and that's one thing um, that's so good, right? They just gave him uh, straight up a hatchet for no reason. Eesh. Yeah. I mean, yeah, I think the hatchet is offensive, but the full cast though is like a different beast. I think the full cast though is definitely like his best new though. Oh, they just the combo, okay. this, this might kill, to be honest, if he, uh, he's got heat and everything. But yeah, okay, can't spend it. Gets the windmill thingy though, the unblockable. Yeah, and looking very strong here again. We're seeing a lot of strong Yoshi plays tonight. Hatchet. Yoshi, when he goes into the heat dash or, you know, the heat engages when he's like plus 15, he's so strong because he has like a multiple unblockables. Like the mind game is so solid for him. Yo, the 10 hit? No way. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can't believe this guy. Nice, that's the, uh, the spins into heat smash, punishes, whatever it is he with. And um, again, uh, that's what you mentioned before when you watch Cobra, right? It's so scary uh, trying to enforce any kind of offense on, on Yoshi. See, he, he yeah, got yeah. that spin right, he got flash, and there's just so many opportunities that he's going to punish you for being aggressive. Yeah, it's like, uh, you know, you really have to, uh, you really question your character or your decisions because you're so used to, you know, the way your offense flows, etc. But when you play against Yoshi, you have to keep in mind he can do these things and... You know, if he gets you with them, it's like you get fucked, you know? Yep. Round one. All right, so here we go. Game two, the hangar. Okay, gets the bad breath whiff punish on the slide. That's kind of crazy. Yeah, classic situation. Oh, it gets the Oki again. <laughs> Yo, we're flying away. Where are you going? <laughs> no way! Holy fuck, that worked! What a setup! <laughs> Dude, schizophrenic capitalizing on Gara's impatience a little bit, I feel. I just fucking wait him up, let him do his dance and stuff. Yeah, honestly, right, you, you just you don't have to approach Yoshi if he's just dancing around. Yeah, just wait, man. Just wait. Okay, go the throw. 
I, I thought that shit didn't hit grounded anymore. That was the nerf. Yeah. But uh, it hasn't been patched yet, right? It's not out, is it? Oh, right. The patch is not out. Right, 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 right. Oh. Doesn't duck the... Oh, another 10 hit? And he's got the sword out. That becomes unblockable. Yeesh. And that is such yeah. a knowledge check, right? But it is. It is. Still and there's out. like so many high, par high parts of that uh, uh, 10 hit. Again, if you don't know, it's uh. Yeah, if you don't know, it's super solid. It gets the tackle, breaks it down. Yep, and the clean walls back. Oh. This is a good situation for Gara. But you know, Yoshi doing his spin away stuff. Nice little tackle, good break though. Okay, Gara on the offense. Never mind, turn around. Was for the okay. Ray oh, nice Ray Chard, that's gonna work. Yeah, he and went I for love... the Sukuku, but not today. It's just a cheeky attempt, right? Didn't work out in the end. But that doesn't kill yeah, though. Still alive. Oh, oh my God! It picks up. Yep. And we'll play it. For that, that's a 2-0 victory. And Gara will go to the losers bracket. That also means that we are slowly... By the way, chat, was the stream blowing up during that match? I was kind of looking over to the side uh, while, you know, while uh, commentating, but I didn't see any drops. So maybe, maybe we're good. Maybe we're good. So we're going to have Ohara up against the Emanon. The next one. Emanon... I'm not familiar with, but they, uh, they've taken out some good players on the way to, uh, 16. France. Do you know, uh, Emanon? Em Emanon? Yeah. No, that doesn't ring a bell. <laughs> I'm sorry. Where is the, uh, I don't have the bracket up. Let me find it. Damn, we got a connection. Well, you should, uh, Koba, you should call a connection test in that case, because I would rather find out that, you know, if it's something consistent, it's routing, stuff like that. Next time, please uh, call a connection test. It's uh, better. And we can take a look. Here we got Uhara, my favorite uh, Asuka. Yo, the Asuka yeah. mirror? Yeah, O'Hara is fucking good, dude. Yeah. He fucked me up once or twice, I think. In ranked, in 7. Uh, yeah, um, well, now it's too late, Quabo. But you can call, if a connection is, like, terribly bad, you can call a connection test and we can have a look at it. See if uh, if it's on, like, either player's side or if it's a routing issue or whatever. We'll do some testing. Or somebody's playing some loud ass music. I can hear like the bass going boom. <laughs> Get ready for the next battle. All right, so you must be able to get some insight in this matchup. What's going on here? Um, well, uh, I I've been saying that before in Tekken Seven. I think it's still true in Tekken Eight. It's a six-four matchup to Asuka. Um, it's pretty good. Oh yeah. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Asuka is I've... very good at punching Asuka. Yeah, I think just playing, you know, nice and slow in the mirror is okay. That's what you got to You, you couldn't, you can't go too crazy because, you know, like you say, you yeah, can you got punish yourself. Easy launch punish and stuff like back three. Not every character gets that. Um, yep. I think also trying to blow up the other Asuka with a back four, a uh, very good button in the in the mirror. Definitely, definitely. But back four just, you know, overall in this game, such a solid button, like super fast cannon launcher, follow ups makes you hesitate, etc. And there we go. Although, if the, you know, back four is very much suited for. I'm sorry, I'm good. <laughs> Doesn't punish the back three, though. 
Oh, and there we go. The Mishima punish. 2 3 punch yeah. with 2 3, you know. Yeah, I could have launched that shit. It's like minus 19. Yeah. It's the honorable way. And there you go. Can easily launch uh, while signing 3 as well, but unfortunately, he doesn't get it. There we go, though. Yeah. Busted down 1 plus 2. Gets hit by the heat smash. Unfortunate. It's just a uh, round start, you know, forward two, why don't you? Yeah, I mean, the other guy started with round, uh, you know, uh, what is it called? The Sabaki. Yeah. Such hard reads. Uh, that's the uh, Asuka way. I would have done the that same. That is the Asuka way. Yeah. <laughs> just fucking go for it. Oh, another. Oh, the minus 10. Yeah. Oh. Guaranteed follow up on FF1. Yeah. That so... is so strong. They, they removed the counter hit launch, right? But you do now get a guaranteed follow up on regular hit, which is also nice. Yeah. I mean, I feel like uh, at the wall it becomes so strong, right? Because you get yeah. the wall splat. Oh, absolutely. I, uh, I always smash it at the wall. The issue yeah. is on Oki, it's kind of awkward. Uh, and if you whiff it, you, you die. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Nice. The, uh, whiff animation. But that's the uh, back, down back to one, two. Sorry. Yeah. There we go. And this heat. And that is one thing, uh, Asuka's heat, not the best, but at the wall, it's very decent. Because suddenly you yeah, can I mean, uh, abuse. Can I throw? Yeah. Down for one connects, but okay. here we go. Closes is out, out with the down four. But yeah, like you said, uh, with Asuka's heat, right? Um, so just, it's very reminiscent of Claudio Heat in that she just gains free access to her install. But yeah. her install is just so much weaker than uh, Claudio's, I feel. Yeah, it's it's pretty good in like some things, like especially at the wall, because a lot of her, her install moves, they will, um, they will have heavy pushback. So you can alleviate that by doing it at the wall, essentially. Oh, yeah, yeah. But it's especially like, uh, I mean, it's not like her game plan or anything changes with the install. Unlike, you know, with Claudio, he suddenly gets like one of the best whiff punishers yeah. with forward 1 plus 2, 1 plus 2, right? But for her, it's just like, all right, she, she gets some pressure. But like you say, there's usually pushback, so it's hard to capitalize on the plus frames. Yeah, absolutely. Here we go. It's going to be what you call the, the Sonic character, Amy. Up against uh, I have no idea. This kind of reminds me of uh, Anna costume, honestly, that Asuka Player 2 one. Maybe it's uh, the eye patch. Oh, stabs it. Oh, nice. Into the forward four, into the unblockable. Oh, nice punish on the back three. That's what you were talking about. So they uh, they have added, um, obviously Asuka can do a mini combo from forward four. She could do that in seven as well. But now the mini combo is way easier. So you either go for the mini combo or you go for the unblockable setup tech. And uh, Eminon definitely favoring the unblockable setup tech, it, it looks like. Ah, it's the <laughs> Down back three. Nice. Yeah. It's down one plus two. Kind of magic four. Yeah, magic four still kind of good on Asuka. Um, decent, you know, before even then it was pretty hard getting full combo. So, yeah. Uh, yeah, I mean, you get almost 50 damage, right? Like, at least 40, I think, yeah. from the Magic 4. So, a little good damage for an 11 frame can hit. Nice dodge! And good punish. Very good, very good. <laughs> the classic ride. So hard to deal with that strength. Gotta yeah, look just... her the second hit to avoid the mix-up. Yeah. And if you can't, you just have to guess. Yes. Second time that's happened. He went for that the last time as well. And Black will cancel into back three, gets punished for it. Oh, hold on. That's not a move I, I think I've ever used in my life. Oh dear, spamming the, the new Sabaki. That shit is like plus, I don't know. It's definitely plus, right? I don't know it's, how much. It's how plus much a more billion at the wall. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's like a wall crush thingy. Yeah, the, the new tactics. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Almost, almost makes the move look good right there. Yeah. 
I, I love that that's officially what it's called, right? It's called New Tactics. <laughs> I mean, it, yeah, borderline official. All right, Jesse, that's Ohara fair. takes it. Yeah, Ohara takes it 2-0 over uh, Emanon, who will go into loser's bracket. Yeah, I feel like that's another thing. Um, I say this all the time, right? Tekken 8 tournaments, man, they are stressful. Uh, compared to Tekken 7, I, I feel like way more stressful. Yeah, dude. It's like in this game, I feel like there is way more cases where you're just checkmate. Yeah. It's like, all right, you, you have to you have to guess and your odds of winning are like 10% or something because the odds are not in your favor. It's yeah. like way worse than in 7, I feel. Or it's like borderline checkmate, right? Yeah, it, it, and it's way easier as well getting to those situations. Um, it is, it is. And it's like, you know, uh, we were talking, uh, I was mentioning earlier about how Dragunov, you have to really guess correctly to get out of his pressure even, right? And I feel like that goes, like Asusana is the same. She was just do running 3-2 until you do something about it. Yeah. Otherwise, you're just stuck in the loop forever. And I feel like that goes for a lot of characters, especially in Heat. Yeah, I, I feel like, yeah, like... Asusena, that's it's a good example. I feel like as a defender, you, you almost don't want to try and step, right? It's so scary. Yeah, exactly, exactly. So it's such, a, to... it's, just, it's, it's such a... It's just such a good situation overall. Yeah, it's like you're constantly in this minus five situation where, you know, if you don't do anything, you're going to keep eating chip. Yeah. But... Um... Is that... Imagine... Heihachi, right? Was it his forward four, his back four? His back four, right? Looping at uh, the wall. Um, that, that was forward four. The, forward uh, four. the axe kick. Yeah, imagine, you know, in this game, Heihachi forward four at the wall, dealing uh, chip damage. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's yeah, what it feels like. Definite. And it's like with Asusana or Dragonov, they don't even have to be near the wall because they have uh, forward momentum in their plus moves, right? Like yeah. Heihachi, he, he did forward four, but he was just kind of... He didn't really close the distance or anything yeah so you had to dash in if you wanted to continue the offense but you know they're just so sticky it's hard to get them off yeah yeah and especially now i think maybe with the changes uh, especially as Senna, it's going to be a bit easier right uh the fact that the second hit doesn't come out if the first whiffs yeah i mean I, I was actually talking with someone about this yesterday that this is like a nerf people who are bad at the matchup at the, because good players will already duck the second hit if yeah. the first hit whips right so i don't know if how much it really solves i i at the end of the day. i think uh like for me I, I would still duck if it's like linear right if the first whiffs but i think the yeah. fact that you can now step it reliably or more reliably because the thing yeah. is like step dubbing step step ducking is much harder than just stepping i think that's definitely true uh so now the fact you can just step uh, makes it, I think, in my opinion, a lot easier to deal with. Just because I'm bad at step ducking. Yeah, I mean, it's definitely less mentally taxing, right? Yeah, exactly. Uh, I think hitbox players probably won't, like, step ducking is very easy in hitbox. On stick, yeah. I suck at it. <laughs> so, yeah. uh, especially if you're stepping, uh, you know, away from the screen, right? Whichever mm. way is up, yeah. hard to step duck. But we got FF versus Degen here. Both good players. And both rocking the, uh, you know, good characters. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Nice, there we A go. Good punish in the FF3, that is exactly minus 14. Yeah, FF3, another move that is uh, kind of busted. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's a good, it has good range, you know, hits grounded, etc. It's like a super good pedal. Round three. <clears throat> I've seen uh, some of the damage you can get out of it, and uh, it's, uh, it's a lot. Oh yeah, true. She gets like a, a kind of unique combo on FF3 that she doesn't get on like downfall 2, etc. Oh, there we go yeah. though. Oh, good combo. Wall was a little bit too close though. Gets the kind of wall standing too. Drops the combo, unlucky. Dijin just kind of in the <laughs> Ling Blender right now. Has a hard time getting up. Yeah. And, and uh, I guess it's wrong. Will it blend? Yes, absolutely it will. <laughs> As a reference, if uh, you're old like me. Nice game to throw. Worry, bro, I got it. 
Okay, FF using its momentum right here. Yeah. So trying to stay in AOP a lot here. Okay. Guess it's right. Oh no, doesn't get the punish on the uh, backflip. Nice, good Very duck. good punish. Can we get the kill here? Yes, we yes, can. We can. Very nice, very nice. So FF of 1 0. Yes. So, Dijin, he used to be a uh, Alyssa player. Does he only play Asusana in this game? Or does um, he also play Alyssa? Do you know? Uh, I've seen him on, I think, uh, Jack as well, of all things. Jack, okay. But usually only goes for that Asusana uh, in high pressure situations. Um, yeah. Definitely a good call. I feel like she is such a good tournament character. You know, she yeah. she's so easy. She's in the driver's seat most of the time. Uh, not to talk smack. I mean, I play as a center myself, so. Exactly. You, you, you can do it. <laughs> yeah. Um, you know, she's just in the driver's seat. She usually has control of the match. And I feel like that's what what's happening wrong here with DJ is that he, you know, he just needs to be in control. And FF is just kind of doing whatever he wants and, you know, he didn't try too much to play the defense game here as well. He just yep. needs to do running 3 2 and, you know, do it over and over again. Yeah, but I mean, again, there we see it's kind of scary against Ling because uh, AOP goes right yeah, under a lot of stuff. Okay, FF feeling, feeling himself. Round starts negative. I mean, it looks like Steven is just kind of freezing up here. Oh, he's doing 10 strings. Oh, good low parry. Don't do that. Oh. Quite able to get to wall there. In. I feel like he really needs to start to spend good duck on the back turn sweep. Yeah, not having it this time around. Nice damage. FF now in rage though. If you can get this round, it's a pretty good momentum shift, I feel. Yeah, but if you lose, right, it's so rough, okay. Yeah, it's so rough. But here we go. Jump. He's just kind of hang hanging back. Yeah. We haven't really seen a running 3-2 from a DJ yet. Oh, there it's, it is. That's speaking up. Right. <laughs> oh, that was kind of funny. Under. Oh, nice! Good punish. Yeah, very, very nice Such there. Thing to throw out. Oh, that works. I had no idea. <laughs> Ooh! Ducks the back turn. This is gonna hurt. Yeah, look at the damage into Rayshard. Into Rayshard. I feel like he could have gotten a bit more here if he used the heat and the wall was right there, but. Yeah. I guess maybe. he wants to save the heat for Oki here, maybe? Yeah, and maybe just want to get all that uh, gray life out of there, but oh, it doesn't yeah, true, work out. But Nash's heat burst just get interrupted by lows. Yeah. Uh, stream might be buffering. It's been uh, having some issues today. I don't know why. Unfortunate. Deacon really likes going for a forward 4-4. Four, four. In general, just the string, string works quite well for him. Gets the power crush. One to one. One to one. <clears throat> so we might see that FF is switching to a bear here. No, okay. Sticks with the Ling, finally. I've been <laughs> telling him so much to just play Ling in tour tournaments and drop these stupid bears. Good stuff. Gets the trick. That's such an awkward cancel to deal with in this game, I feel. Or, I mean, it wasn't even in T7, right? Gets the punish and the power crash. Yeah. Very nice. Let's 
facing. Look at the damage on the wall combo. Okay. Good rage art. Yeah. I mean, it I'm works out, right? But... Almost guaranteed in that situation. She's stuck in hypno stance, so there's. And she can't block. And look at all that gray life, though. <laughs> Yeah, okay. he only needs one heat engage and he's good. Oh, get the power crush there. Yeah. Watch to do, unfortunately, and set point for FF. Oh, that wasn't a clean hit, really. <laughs> okay. Yeah. yeah, FF did some adjustments and it's clearly working out. Good break on the back turn throw. That's a that's a true 50-50, you have to guess. Or you duck it, but gets the counter or it's, I think that's just regular hit forward four. Again caught the hitness hunts with Rage Art. Okay. Full amount of damage. Okay, both players in heat. Nice! This is wrong. Gets this hell sweep. The leg. Just uh, Fire get. Firecracker. Legion's staying down this time. But there we go. Enters heat. Will this be the checkmate? Oh, so close. Oh, he didn't follow up. But that's gonna be a good low poke to finish it off. Yep, yeah, and that is uh, FF taking it two to one over Degenerate. Love to see it. Yeah, very well played. Chat, let me just. I don't think it's gonna do anything. Um, it's so the weird thing is right that usually OBS would say, "Hey, hey, big fella, your your stream is blowing up. What the fuck?" I was not saying anything. Um, trying re let me see something in settings here. I'll try restarting the game. I don't think that's gonna work realistically, but and if it doesn't, I can turn the bitrate down. But I don't think the bitrate would do anything for that. They added like the anti mod stuff right on Tekken, I feel like. Oh. I have no idea. Like um I just know when I launched the game today, it took like ages for the game to launch for some reason. I don't know what it was. We'll try restarting. See. Probably not gonna do any or make any difference, but you know. We out here we we try. <laughs> I mean, maybe it helps, you know? You never know. Yeah, you never know. Because I don't think the, the stream is not buffering uh, when we don't have games on, right? So it's either, like, my PC blowing up or the game blowing up my PC stream. Yeah. Like, it's not... I don't know if anyone's been watching for long. It's never buffering when I'm... Like, when we're just like this, right? I mean, there's not a lot of moving pictures, I think. It seems like it buffers when there's a lot of moving stuff going on. Yeah. That, that's a different a uh, different TO sign for the nude mods. That's so funny. Uh, it created a whole incident. Um, like, they legit Capcom banned uh, mods uh, after, you know, that TO um, that they, they accidentally had a nude mod on stream. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah, so it's they actually created like a split in the timeline, you know? <laughs> oh my god, that's that funny is, though. That's that funny. Is so funny. I mean, it's it makes sense why they would do it. To be honest, it's fucking embarrassing. I feel. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, let's try. I'll just be right back. Two minutes, right? Yeah. No worries. Um, after this match, by the way, we'll swap. So. Okay. I mean, no no reason for me to be right back then. I'll just wait. Uh, 
Uh, it is uh, Ohara and um, Schizophrenic 69. It's going to be Asuka up against Yoshi. Oh, you heard the stream? Alright, that's good. Yeah. <clears throat> and they're having a party upstairs. <laughs> Excited, dude. I'm, I'm jealous, dude. Jealous? You just joined them, man. <laughs> that would be kind of weird. It would, yeah. <laughs> uh all right so let's see if this uh does anything or maybe it is just uh game blowing up my pc it if anything it should be my cpu blowing up uh because my cpu is kind of not the best but everything else should be way more than fine for this yeah but this is the first time this has happened as well right yeah like, you know, uh and i have but i haven't played the game in like um in like a week or so and haven't streamed it in two weeks so something could have happened in between with like uh versions of obs or something yeah, yeah definitely yeah or you know twitch heavy so my internal like blame for this is that we both have the pgl major finals right now and the rocket league league something finals uh which has like 300k uh, 200k views together i mean it, it could definitely be uh you know because of twitch because like, like i said earlier it's like uh, the stream is fine for me on discord yeah but it could also be obs right so it's like one of those two things yeah it could be the server that i'm using uh you know you have to you automatically go on like a server um to stream on I could yeah, be. Yeah, yeah. This one is stingy. Yes. It's probably in Sweden or something. Yeah, I bet. <laughs> <laughs> well, hopefully we'll see if it's good or bad. This one we got Mr. Uh, Mr. Yoshi hopping in and out the lobby a couple times. All right, mm -hmm. we're trying again. So our first winners semi-final match here. Ohara up against Schizophrenic 69. The legend. All right. Hopefully. Okay, thank God. Get ready for the next battle. Oh, huh, that's weird. Alright, anyways, we'll see. I need a screen share. Okay then. By the by the way. By the way, okay, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> the float nice yeah and i feel like this stage um it, it's always kind of a little bit annoying as asuka yeah i definitely would agree that she's pretty good with walls i mean her mix-up is a mix-up that exists it's just so much stronger the wall right yeah like especially in heat oh that kills that did a lot of damage what the fuck yeah and the, the stream buffered god damn it well <laughs> Nothing to do, I guess. <laughs> GG's. Okay. Para having the install here. Nice punish, but it's, it's a float on Ducky. Just goes forward a little bit. 
Yeah, that shit is like impossible to punish. Good, good. down back one, two. Yeah. <clears throat> and the down back four. Right here. It's such a good round ending. It's good range. Mine is 11 only. Yeah, a bit it's slow, safety. right? So uh, still scary to it throw It is a out. bit slow, oh. but... You know what? Maybe it's the upstairs party. You know, it's maybe the torrenting music up there. I don't know. Torrenting music while playing it. That's impressive. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Good combo, though. Yep. Alright. Doesn't work out. One, three. Try to go for the size of two. Dude, I gotta get used to punishing that. So weird. Yeah, so um, still, I rarely see people do it. <laughs> no, oh my god, no! he gets the fucking key chart thing. Bro. This might kill. If it doesn't like combo. Real. Or it's gonna, it's gonna be close at least. Just for the unblockable. Oh. Yeah. Went for the cheeky set. Should have just gone for that, um, the rage shot there, I feel like. I don't know. But I guess he, he wanted to keep it tricky, but. So when she does her uh, her new throw into like the can't mix up, right? Is it just better to go for the mix up rather than like one plus two or down one plus two or something like that? Uh, you can't you can't really do it. Um, oh really? So you're stuck okay. in the can't mix up, yeah. Weird. Yeah. It's not particularly good, I think. Nah, I mean it's yeah. Like you you got the mid, you can kind of threaten with the mid, right? Um, yeah, yeah, but the, I mean the mid is just. Like, okay, it's a heat engage, but it doesn't really do much, I guess. Yeah, and and the low, you know, you die. Uh... <laughs> yeah, like minus 18, all right. Gets the size to two. Us can heat. Nice Good game to float, eight. Oh, gets the flash. That's what I'm talking about. The unblockables. Schizophrenic taking the first game yeah just goes with that all right let me try by setting the bitrate down a bit maybe that helps that's something i can do without killing the stream okay i'll see if that does anything <clears throat> you vpn to netherlands and now it's uh so, so it's like a regional Twitch issue, essentially? That's so weird. But I can't make any logic on that, I'll be honest. Like, it makes sense that it might be the server you're watching on, so in certain European countries, it might be messed up. I don't know. Not weird, though. I mean, let's yeah, see. But you're three, you, you're, yeah. <laughs> yeah I, I can't make any logic of that either. But. I, Fru yeah. Fruity is a uh, stream viewer legend, so it's uh, I believe it. Yeah. I I haven't had any issues uh, myself lately. Yeah, exactly. It uses different servers for different regions. It's running up here. The back four, and again, that's why it's good, right? Counter hit tool, got follow ups. Yeah, dude. It's like, uh, you know, Ooh. especially because it has follow ups as well. Like, in 7, there was a lot, of, a lot of these kinds of moves. You know, 15 frame, 16 frame kind of launches. But they didn't have follow ups, so there was, like, never anything going on after. But this one it does, so it's all, like, always a mid, like, a. You can play a bad mind game, so to say. Yeah. Okay, but there's, like, four seconds less. No! Oh, oh sh it whiffs. No, unlucky. Oh, oh no! my god, goes for the suicide and hits it. I mean, that is so smart, man, right? Because it is. you have to kill. You need a lot of damage really fast. And what do you do? You know? Just fucking kill yourself. <laughs> yeah. I mean, that's a way. I mean, it worked out for him pretty well right there. Goes for the setup again. That has worked on, like every time so far. Gets the 
Plus 24, that is guaranteed. Oh, never mind. That kills. <laughs> Maybe he didn't mash it correctly. Pretty sure it was guaranteed in 7. I don't think they changed it for this game. Rainbow drop? Uh uh. Oh. It's not work. Oh, he gets the unbreakable. Oh, he gets the bad breath. And it's looking very rough here for Ohara. There we go. He explodes the floor into OK. Oh, what was the pushback right there? Dude, that is so hard to deal with. Oh, tried to go for the seppuku again. And gets the flash. Very nice play from Schizophrenic. Yep, thanks. It. Yep. Quite convincing too. Good job. So a 2-0 win right there. Actually, with the server region thing it could be that um that now i'm just spitballing it could be because we have the copenhagen major going on right now on the danish servers right right uh, that's like more than 100k viewers on the puny danish server maybe that does something yeah, who knows sure. anyways anyway, i'm gonna take my leave yeah. have a good stream Good luck in top eight, etc. Peace, yeah. peace, peace, peace. If, if people want to, you know, if, if people want more fonts, if they thought, man, what an irresistible smile on that guy right there. <laughs> what a fucking gremlin. Yeah, what can they... I stream like I stream like once a year, so. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Anyway, you guys have a good one. Peace, 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 peace. All right. See you, man. And uh, welcome to uh, Kobe. What's good, man? Hello, man. I'm excited to be back. Salty you top eight. We're at it again, man. We're at it again. <laughs> yeah. Let me just. I uh, gotta do some sound settings real quick. Oh. Of course, of course. Had it set up all weird here. But... Yeah, we have some uh, familiar faces in in top eights and going forward as well. You know. Uh... We've seen FF uh, throughout the tournament, Degenerate, also uh, in Losers Van 5 right, right now, DNTG also in there, Not Cat, and uh, obviously you just saw uh, Schizophrenic and O'Hara go you know, at it in that last game there. So yeah, some familiar faces, some familiar names, and uh, while we're waiting for the next one, of course, you can uh, go onto the match, match arena, as Fleecy says. Uh, type in exclamation mark Macharino and claim a completely free code to add 25 cents to the prize pool for completely free. So uh, please go ahead and do that. Yep. I couldn't have said it much better myself. And there we go, there's Obi. Hello, hello. Name on there as well. <laughs> so I wonder. Actually, if I should quickly, I don't even think restarting the stream is going to work. Too bad. Oh, no. I'm dying all day. Don't know why. Oh, no. Please, OPS. Please, Twitch. Hi. <laughs> it's odd, though, well, right? Well, right now, uh, coming up to the stream, it will be Lona and FF. Uh, Going to play each other. Then in just a sec. Yes, absolutely. Excited to see more FF. Obviously, uh, we saw some FF gameplay last week, and uh, I know the chat were loving it. So excited to see some more FF. Yeah. Insult EU, of course. Oh, wait a second. <laughs> oh no, what's happened? So last week, last time, yes. right, we had we had a little bit of a theory and that is uh, oh. that Fran is actually a loner and now I can see Fran oh. is typing in the stream matches channel. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder <laughs> I just wonder, you know. <laughs> Sometimes you just wonder, huh? Yeah. Oh, 
But yes, absolutely. Uh, you know, oh, it's uh, there we go. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> sometimes these things uh, go go unnoticed. Huh? Yeah. But there you go. Yes. Bro, you go back like two weeks. We <laughs> like evil actually called it right there. Uh, yeah. So uh, there's there's an interesting concept here. I know in um, Age of Empires 2, uh, which is still a very popular esport by the way, they do a hidden tournament, which is where everybody who signs up, they have to use a different tag, so you don't know who the, who you're playing against, because obviously uh, you can tell what like army they use and what what strategies they tend to use by by their tag. So you don't know who you're going up against in bracket. I think. I think Than changing their tag <laughs> got the mix up there <laughs> with that one. But um but going we... interestingly enough, right, going with the uh Zafina here. Yes, the Zaf. And you don't really see that much uh Zafina in Tekken 8 um, so so far. I, I know I haven't seen that many in tournament, especially this high in tournament, but that's a big counter hit to start things off. Fourth Than right there. Uh, am I breaking the illusion? Do I have to say Lona? <laughs> oh, you can. Well, Pran already said so, right? So. Oh, uh, yeah, I guess so. But yes, here we go. Good, be, good block on the low, and that's a good punish there as well. Just playing really slow Tekken at the minute, like turn taking Tekken, you know? Very interesting. The pace of the game is not normally this slow, especially in Tekken 8. But that's a great punish on the whiff heat burst with the heat smash, and that's going to be round one for Than. We're streaming a loser's side uh, before um, we move on to the next final. So, and it's interesting, right? We've got one of the arguably you know, top tiers against the uh, lower tier here. Yes. Um, <laughs> I, I wonder oh. what opted the switch from Alisa to Sabina. Interesting. Yes. And also, I'm surprised that the rage are there. I don't really like this option because of the scaling. I mean, it removes the gray hell yeah. from the combo, of course. It, it is. It is uh, actually way better than you know you'd think because in this situation, you kill with one combo anyways, right? Yes. Of uh, course, yeah. But if they have the gray health, they can suddenly. You know, recover so suddenly you're two hits away instead of one hit. So I, I do understand why you would the idea, yeah, yeah. Get rid of it. Okay. Now the low check coming through. Going to go into stance and the launcher, but can't complete the combo. Okay. Low check's coming through. What's for Oki? Nothing there. Just look at the patience between these two. My goodness. Van getting the best out of these infractions though, and that's a counter hit, and it's going to pick up the launch and the combo. We're gonna spike down with the heat burst. And I don't think that's completely optimal, but that's gonna be a rage art for a big chunk of damage on the counter hit. Ooh, goes under over! My goodness, side swish! The dick jab and... That's good poking from Fran to pick up game number one. Yep. Must act before it's too late. Fran goes up one to zero. Interesting game one. Uh... You know, a lot slower than you'd expect it to be, especially, I think, with those two characters on the field of play, but, you know, we're here for surprises, right? <laughs> Absolutely. One thing I did I did find interesting there was that, you know, uh, the stance play was actively the uh, forcing the interactions to almost be slower, but now we're going to be seeing a different sort of stance. We're going to be seeing the hunting bear stance from FF with a switch to the panther, to the panda. Nope. Oh, go fast. Oh god. Yes. 
But we've caught up now, and that is going to be to the wall, going to be the heat burst to get the extra wall damage there. And the low is blocked, but this is looking dangerous. Yes, and it will be. It's going to be FF picking up the first round with the bear. Okay, that's going to be the heat engager there. Going to get the plus things down to the wall, but a nice sidewall out. We're going to put Than in an advantageous position. But that's a big counter hit there. Off the trade. But Than going to push this to the wall. This could be a wall break. But not going to do it. There it is. Yep, wall break coming through. I'm waiting for a rage art to keep it simple. Doesn't go for it. Goes for the heat burst instead to the wall. And it picks up the round anyway. Good stuff from Than there. To go for that execution. Instead of just going for uh, the rage art. I know most would, but hop kick off a round start. Wall. Look at that damage. Half life already gone. Obviously, Fran can get some life back, but not like I that. Yeah, absolutely. That was absolutely brilliant launcher there from FF. But FF really needs to put some damage on the board now. Get off of me! Good duck underneath, and that's to the wall. Can't get much off of it. Oh, the side wall carries. Uh oh, oh, the wall. Oh man! Yeesh. Wild. Yeah, the slow mo made that one very exciting, but you know, Fan not very happy about that one. Gonna just start this one off with some damage. Okay, gonna keep going with the strings. The patience to stay in stance there from Fan. That was raw, but FF ready for it. Gonna send Loader to the wall. Good dick jab there. Stop the pressure. Go check again and again. And oh my god, this is dangerous. Be careful here. Oh, that whiff whiff. and the rage up! It's 2 2. Yes, absolutely. What a sidestep from Fan there. That forced the whiff out. Huge from Fan. Now, went to round number 5. There's the Heat Engager coming through. Hunting Bear, going to get stopped by the Heat Burst. And to the wall we go, but great fight out of the wall from Fan there. It's still in Hunting Bear after all this time. FF really looking for it. Can't to get it off though. There we go. Heat spent now. We're playing Tekken 7, finally. Yes. Okay. Going to look for the plus themes. Can't get much off of that one. The Spring Kick blocked. There. Punish. Oh, wait a second. Getting the launch. Oh. Won't quite be able to kill here, but it's gonna be close. Oh, the Rage Art. Okay, bringing it through. The scaling gonna be very high on that one, but at least gonna remove the Grey Health. So now, Than in a very difficult position here. Went for the jab with that. The low Ooh. blocked. And that's gonna be FF picking up the game. Excellent. Block and punish. Awesome round there. And we might see Than making a switch, actually. Could very easily be a Than switch here. Off of the win from FF. So let's see if that happens. Get ready for the next it battle. will be a fan switch, just as I predicted, but it will be the Leo this time around. Interesting. Going with a you know, different character here, round saying one. Safina wasn't doing it. It was a very close match, though. It required a yeah, huge comeback from FF. Yes. Up kick, okay. Oh, that whiff. Drops the combo. Yeah, and this is what happens after playing a certain character for a while. You might just find your execution is a bit iffy on the other characters, but Than seems to be picking it back up now with that wall carry. Yep. Good 
combo block there. The heat smash gonna come through, get some chip damage. Jumping up. No check, go. Yeah. There's going to be the launch right there from FF. That's not going to take it to the wall, unfortunately. Not enough. Just high lows, high lows from Fan right now. But there's the hop kick. But drops the combo again. That's the second hop kick combo box. Loss. Yep, that is two rounds straight. Set point here for Fran. Yeah, the heat burst coming through to pick up that round. And even though the combo drops are coming through on this Leo, Fran doesn't seem to need them. So here we go. Potentially the last round of this set right here. Hello, we're gonna get into that armor as well. Jabbing. Okay, oh wait a day. second. Full we'll sweep as well. Looking really rough here for FF. Needs to find a way out. Yes, yeah, at the wall. Good duck. Needs to find a way to fight out of here, but it's looking dangerous now. Yeah, this might be it. Yes, it will be. And it's a no-round round for Fan, who will be moving on in the winner's side. Very, very clean there. And that means FF will uh, have to run it back in Lucy's side of things. And uh, that means we got a little bit of a wait here. Um, yes. So the next match we're waiting on... Uh, Yali is playing uh, Lord Gaga and uh, Degenerate yes. is playing a Gov Gang, so we'll see how it goes. Absolutely, I mean, that's the power of a character switch, right? Yeah. That That is the power of a character switch. You saw that, um, you know, you, um, you saw FF switch to the Panda, bring a game back, and then you saw the Leo switch from Fan, and that brought a game back to win the set as well, so, you know, uh, just cha it, it completely changes the timing of the game, right? It, yeah. By by switching characters, your opponent is now used to one sort of timing and has to switch to, you know, a different type of timing on your other character, and it may take a while for them to adjust to that. And within that time, you can, you know, get the game. So that's that's really the power of a good character switch. Yeah. And uh, perfect. We just got one losers match that was about to start that just caught yes. uh, so we're gonna have a yali up against the lord gaga on stream brilliant lord gaga used to play uh anna in uh, tekken 7 um really really strong from spain yali uh should be familiar with right it's uh from france play yes, shall you yeah i mean you know actually what i've been really seeing that i've been really enjoying recently in the community is uh the, the Spanish community have been coming out in full force for these European tournaments. I mean, I was just on uh, Corner to Corner this past Thursday, and uh, there was about three or four Spanish players on that just coming through in the in the top side of bracket. And so they've been really, really pushing their community in, in Tekken 8 to participate in tournaments and uh, show themselves and come out there. So absolutely amazing stuff from, from the Spanish community right now. Yeah, I mean, it's uh, historically one of the strongest regions that we have in Europe, right? Got a mm, lot of, course, of really, yeah. really good players. Um, we just need a Spanish major, you know? Where, where's the Spanish yeah. major? I, I just always wonder. Right, we, need, we need that one, please. We're waiting for it, man. <laughs> but yes, we will be heading into this game relatively soon. Um gonna be interesting to see what happens here. uh check hmm. hopefully um oh there you go lord gaga's in the chat yeah. To, oh, uh, wait a second. We got a $5 donation from uh, Gwoof. Oh, no wow. message. Thank, Thank you. you very much, Gwoof. And that means we are $27.87. Again, reminder chat. Uh, something very exciting starting this month. Uh, not quite, or next month, sorry. Not quite ready to announce it yet. It will be happening late uh, next month. Um, I'm just in the works of getting like everything sorted with uh, 
you know, all the uh, promotional material, stuff like that. It takes a while, uh, especially Slice when you're me. Yes. Uh, but expect it to be announced within like one or two weeks. Ooh, stay tuned, everybody. Stay tuned. You won't want to miss that. Yeah, very I, I, I can tell. I can tell you anything. You do not want to miss it. It's going to be exciting, to say the least. Mm. I think so. And if I think so, you know, I'm right. Obviously. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> yeah. Well, you guys at home know whenever Salty U does anything, you know they do it right. So you don't want to miss this one. But we have got both players in the lobby right now. Yeah. Uh, both may be on the link. We'll see if uh, Lord Gaga is going to be sticking to this character here in the Ditto. But we are getting ready to spectate and we will see if it is a Ditto and it will be a Ditto on Secluded Training Ground right now. Interesting to see. Oh, Hakobi's secret Smash player? I see how it is. <laughs> I used to commentate Smash before uh, Tekken. Alright, here we go. Fight. Yo, the Tekken 7 against the uh, you know, custom. Yeah, okay. I, I think the Tekken 7 outfit really clean. Nice! Yeah, okay, stepped to wow. the side. Yeah, absolutely. Now pushing forward here. To the wall we go, but a good fight out, but staying there, unfortunately. Lord Gaga with pressure, unfortunately, unfolding. And it's going to be the heat smash that's going to be picking up the van. Round two. Yeah, that for Yali. Oh, underneath the high. There's going to be a solid amount of damage there. But a launcher okay. back. Nice oh, good man. launch. Yeah, great launch there. And you can see this combo actually uh, goes to the side a little bit, but readjusted by Yali to take it to the wall. I love that little sidestep mid combo. That was a beautiful adjustment. Fight. And uh, just like that, it's all even one to one in the launch. Ooh. Big, big, big moves coming out from both of these players in this matchup right now. Yali taking most of it. Grab gets broken there. Okay. Pressure low. A little bit of patience. Yali with a huge life lead here. Oh, no punish. Oh, just going back and forth now. And go. that's going to be stopping the string. And that, that is going to be a round on the board for Lord Gaga. Oh, it's Yali. Yali up 2 1 oh. now. <laughs> yes. Yali's in the red. Yes, sorry, apologies. Um, Half-Life gone. Oh, enters heat as well. This is going to be very rough, but Gaga here. All the plus frames oh, in the man. world. Eesh. Amazing stuff from Yali there. To be picking up that game number one, but it was... I think that first game was actually kind of scrappy because there was so many big moves getting thrown out there. It seemed to be launch after launch after launch after launch between these two. There was a uh, one interaction where I could say the game slowed down really, and uh, that was in game number three. Uh, sorry, round number three. But apart from that, just uh, guns blazing in this one. Yep. Get ready but yes, for we the will be going battle. into it, and it is going to be. The same again with the Lings coming through, at, but this time it will be on Yakushima. Bit of yep. a bigger stage. And we don't have any, you know, obviously, those wall pressure, very good right the back the stance. And, um, we don't have any of that right here. I just want to say, what are those shoes? What are those crepes that, that are being worn right now? They're clean. Don't worry about it. Like, uh, you know, wooden clocks. Okay, I see. Oh, just purple. Well, Lord Gaga picking up the round and the hop kick there on the round start of round number two. Much favoring this stage and changing the timing so they can get the launcher again. Okay, Lord Gaga really wants this game number two to bring it back. Heat Dash going to continue the pressure and it's going to be a seven golden letters. Yep. It's a quick 2-0 lead here. Yali needs to change something off stage. Maybe not working, I don't know. Yes, absolutely 
now. Oh, the parry. Wow. Nice. Throw. Yeah, goes unbroken there. And again goes unbroken. That's going to be a combo and death, I think. Yes, perfect back. Anything you can do, I can do better. Fight. Absolutely. You can't. Nice to throw. Now, goes over under there. Nothing to do. Just and run alone. up Snake Edge. <laughs> I love it. Okay, now Yali with a double perfect. Final Three rage. perfect in a row there. From this game no so way. far. And another launch. No way. Not like this. Okay, there we go. Okay, okay. Round saved, you know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But this is a must win for Lord Gaga. You know, they could be out of the tournament right here. You're spinning. Nice. Keep the float. Okay. Hey. Hey, hey. Oh, drops it. Yeah, another float, though. That, that might kill. Yeah, with spike. It will, it will. Yep. You nice. Yali taking it 2 wow. over Lord Gaga. Will be sent out of the tournament on a 9th place here. Yes. But that's what I said in, in game number 1, right? That these two were just going for launch after launch after launch after launch. And that's why you saw three perfects in a row in game number two, right? They were just really going for it, like throwing out all of the uh, kind of more notable risky options that you'd see from, from Ling. Yeah. Um, but I guess that is also technically a, a, what would be a timing mix up in this matchup because, you know, when you would do normally do a launcher, right? Uh, that would change according to what character you're playing against. And if you're playing against a Ling, as a Ling player, you really want to be changing that timing. So doing those big launches in neutral infractions are unexpected against, you know, someone who plays your character as well. Whereas yeah. they might know a lot of other things like your flame data and everything else, right? And uh, we are actually just going to stay uh, with Yali here. Uh, we don't okay. quite have the other match ready yet. So it's going to be Yali up against the NTG. Uh, the NTG, okay. obviously, um, check player place last. Yes. Interesting matchup here. I mean, I saw uh, the NTG has been entering a couple of these as well and uh, has been placing very well recently. So yep. we'll see if the oh. run of form can stay up. Oh, shit. Neku with a $30 donation. Holy Ooh. hell. Ooh. What a legend. Thank you very much. No message as well. But that means we are at almost wow. $60 right now. If we get 21 codes claimed, just saying if we get even like a little bit of that claimed, we actually will reach 60 bucks. And I believe that is enough for top three payout. So if you go. haven't, please go ahead, claim a code. Would be highly appreciated. Of course. And, uh, right. One thing that I've seen uh, actually uh, with the patch notes recently that I've just released, of course, uh, is uh, Lars's dynamic entry has changed just a little bit, uh, if I'm not mistaken, right? Yeah. Um, I know it's a, an adjustment rather than a, a buff or enough, but uh, I know they have changed uh, dynamic entry just a little bit, and so uh, it'll be interesting to see how that how that works in the future on uh, you know uh, what will be the April patch. We'll see. So we're just waiting on the NTG here. Still, let me just um, let me let me. Bah, 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 bah. With that being said, uh, myself, I am of course very happy uh, because I get my character on Monday. <laughs> um, very excited to be uh, doing some discovery with, with Eddie Gordo. Um, and maybe I might enter one of these, uh, finally. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. I finally Thank you very much, uh, Neku. Thank you very much. Well, I appreciate yes. it. Yo, uh, DNTG making Emperor. Okay. There we go. DNTG. Both in the lobby right now, and uh, you know, let's get right to it. I'm very excited. This is going to be a very interesting matchup, I think. Uh, if if Yali keeps on the same ideas that they had in the last set with uh, the big launches, they could surprisingly catch some of DNTG's dynamic entries uh, with Lars. So needs to be careful here if uh, you know 
Yali is throwing out those big launches there. Get ready so for the next also, uh, can anyone let me know, is the stream still on life support? Or has it gotten better? <laughs> it's been like rough all night for some reason. And I wonder... Yeah. I, I really do wonder if it's a Twitch issue or a like, me issue. I'm sure it's probably a Twitch issue. Yeah. But the Snake Edge on round start! That's gonna be absolutely huge because it's gonna take the NDTG to the wall. And it's gonna be a lot of pressure. Ooh, okay. Gonna bring it back now. Has the health lead. That's good. Yeah, that's gonna be the round right there. Getting that pick up off of the knockdown. And that's buffering. Got that. Yeah, bye -bye. <laughs> oh no. PNTG picking up round number one there. Power crash coming through. Good backdash, but can't get anything off of it. Man, Yali. That was some really good movement. Unfortunately, couldn't get the punish there. Bit of a scrappy interaction, but Yali does get the snake edge off and going to get the combo to the wall. Can't get anything off of the wall splat though. Just gonna sidestep around and try and mix up with the directions. Ooh, Ooh nice jump parry. too far away. But again, like you said, nice parry. Here we go. Sweep off the leg. Grab goes unbroken. It's gonna be to the wall. Yeah, look at the time. Wall messes it up. You don't have time to block. Nope. Yeah, no time there to block. Low check coming through. Big damage there. Now, just stopping the pressure. Dynamic entry comes through. Little bit of poking. You can see Yali slowing the game down a little bit more now. Nudely and go. Now gets in the lead, two rounds to one. The yeah, NTG in a bit of trouble. Yeah, absolutely. Good duck, but the grab gonna come through and go unbroken there. Okay, bit of movement. Pressure at the wall. The NTG needs to do something here, but gets caught and floated out the air. Still at the wall. The grab again goes unbroken for the NTG. This is gonna become a problem in game number two. And that's going to be seven golden letters to finish off game number one. Yeah. Absolutely. PNTG, I think, really needs to start breaking these grabs because uh, Yali has been getting a lot of mileage out of them recently. Yeah, I mean, uh, Xiaoyu, right, got the full package uh, in regards to the throws, so definitely not mm -hmm. a character. Oh, definitely a character, sorry, where you can get a lot of... Uh, my shout that because again if you have the full package you have a throw that uh you know can launch well that's yes. quite good absolutely now back again to the training ground round one wall breaks are plenty here they're gonna be a whiff on round start and dntg is going to capitalize gonna take yali to about half health and now this could be a perfect of their own, but the power crash comes through. Stop that from happening. Ooh, goes over the top. Wall break. Connecting. There's going to be a lot of damage here. Okay, low check. Still have. Has heat in the back pocket. And heat is going to be activated here. Goes over the top. Ooh, oh my days. Oh, on a hit. Okay, both players still in rage. Oh, did we get the second hit? But there we go. Round the NGG. Okay. Just backing up again all the way and trying to find a different way to engage. But the NTG with another good start to this round number two, just as in round number one. But a lot of movement coming out from Yali right now. Ooh. Nice getting down Ooh, and hit. Clean wolf bat as well there. Oh yes, and now big combo coming through for Yali. I'm not sure if this kills though. 
it does with the heat dash. That's going to be one round apiece heading into round number three. One. Coming in, there we go. Ooh, yeah, that's going to be... Yeah. Pick up to the wall we go. Not the breakable one, fortunately, for Yali. A lot of grey health to build it back up here. But the launch... Back off a bit. Oh. Oh, okay. Cancel quest very low here. Yes. Valley connects. Big Remember, Yali out of here. Still does have heat and going to use it here. To the wall we go. Yeah, that's dangerous and that's not going to be the round, but the low check is. Yali picking up round number three there. One more to move on. Ooh, power crush there, going to stop the pressure. Kali Bowl gets stopped by DNTG. And the Lopari coming through. Can't get a wall splat. No way. The armor. Let's get the follow up there. Good block on the lows there, knowing there was a second hit as well. Good stuff. Final round. Final round. Here we go. Ready and fight. Okay, backing up. Let's check. Yeah. Okay, OP. This time doesn't work out though. Nice. Okay, in the throw as well. DNTG jumping up. What are we doing? You know, we got Aquama flips. Fine. Yes. Good block on the low there from DNTG and does get a small punish on it. Again, oh, one this round. could be a problem. Uh oh. Yeah. Those frames. Good luck so. Good dick jab to get out of oh. there too, and oh, another not full whip, punish. no And that is it. Yali moves wow. on to oh, barely takes it. What an yeah, ending, like, man. Ish. Very scrambly there at the end, and uh, the NTG could have capitalized, I think, a couple of times in that ending in infraction. Yeah. But can get the damage out, unfortunately, and it will be Yali moving on in the bracket. And they will be uh, moving on to play against FF yeah. in uh, the losers' semi-finals. So that's actually a match we've seen as well. I do believe in uh, Tekken Seven a couple times. Uh, mm. Both players, you know, have been joining for Tekken Seven. So uh, don't know who usually won those ones though. But before that, we are going to take a trip down to the other side of the losers' bracket. We're going to have Mateos YM up against Gov Gang. So it's going to be um, Yoshi, I believe, up against Leroy. Of course. Mateos uh, used to play Kunimitsu. Mm. Interesting. Okay, I see. And while we're waiting for that game, we still have 21 codes left. So please do claim a code for completely free. Adds 25 cents to the prize pool. And obviously, if we get up to $60 in that, uh, the top three will get paid out. So be sure to do that and uh, support these amazingly talented players who have come out today to uh, show their stuff and show their skills. Yeah, I mean, what we at least like uh, 80 people in chat, right? That, mm -hmm. you know, that means only less than half have claimed a code. Yes. You know, that math, you know, I'm not the best at math. You know, don't uh, get me wrong here. <laughs> but, uh, But yes, uh, Govgang coming out here and, you know, I really like seeing the Leroy because I don't get to see much Leroy. Um, I, I don't think a lot of people have seen enough Leroy, to, to be fair. There's been multiple tournaments going on, you know, uh, like we said, Wanted and Corner to Corner, um, which, of course, Wanted this salty user qualifier for, so be sure to check that out on Tuesdays. But, um... We don't see enough Leroy, I, I don't think, in these online events or even offline events currently because, you know, I, I'm not sure if it's the strength of the Get character or the whatnot if uh, the Leroy players don't want to play him, but well, just don't see him enough. Leroy wasn't exactly that popular towards mm. the end of Tekken 7's life, right? I know mm. one of the best ones, uh, Dustiel, uh, plays, you know, uh, on 4G, so therefore can't play in most tournaments, unfortunately. But he's uh, the... Th 
Probably the strongest Leroy player I can think of uh, that we have from Finland right now. Uh, yeah, just apart from that, we don't have that many Leroy players, right? Moving around the neutral now, the mist coming through. Yeah, please, somebody hand Yoshi some mints, man. Yeah. It's smelly. <laughs> I have been seeing a, a lot more uh, utilization of uh, Yoshimitsu Mist as well. Uh, I saw Schizophrenic using it a lot earlier as well. But that's gonna be the flash. Very nice flash. Oh! Woo! Little setup. Very cheeky. In the parry! And that kills. Man. That's big right there. And now we're into round number two. Oh, whiffs there, and Govgan going to get the correct punish and the pickup. Yo, Ganga, Ganga, Ganga. Wow. Those days were uh, interesting. Yeah. Okay, taking the sword away, I see a lot of uh, Yoshimitsu's uh, go for that and all sorts of stats. Pretty interesting, right? Yes. Uh, definitely a lot more common occurring than uh, it was in Tekken 7. Absolutely, now a lot of damage coming out Thank from you, Mateus. Man. To the wall we go, big damage here. Oh my goodness, that's going to kill. Wall to wall there. Uh. Nice to down forward too. Yeah, Such great. a good move. We're talking about, yep. you know, Yoshi has a lot of moves that's buff. A lot of good new moves. But still, the good old reliable down forward too might still just be the best one. Oh yeah, for sure. And now... Checks and the launch. It's going to be great for Govgang. Can heal up all of this gray health as well and still has heat on the horizon. Yeah, going to activate it there to keep the pressure at the wall against Mateus and the heat smash immediately to take away some of the chip damage. But heat burst back. Yeah. Now heat activated the mix. Ooh. Oh, yeah, that's going to be over. Oh, no. Yeah, Side wall shenanigans. Going for the lull. And that was just what was that three lows in a row? Fearless Gov Gang and suddenly steals away that round. Yeah. yeah. Didn't seem like it was going to go their way, but did pick it up and now we yeah, are we on the floor blast. And yeah, we've got the Mickey Mouse mode activated right now. Yeah, the cartoons coming through. Going around this neutral now and Gov Gang really taking it to Mateus. But great stop of the pressure from Mateus, and this is going to pick up a lot of damage here. Ooh. Let's get the yeah. ender. But yeah, there we go, Mickey Mouse combo, and that is going to make Should it be all it. even. Two to two. Yes. Final round. Final round into game number one. This is big. Yeah, what a good set so far. Both players very even skill. Absolutely. No. To activate the heat burst. Gonna try and get out of the corner with that and does so. The jab are gonna try and stop the pressure. But there we go. Look at the damage. Oh, Ooh, the, heat the heat smash, smash. does not kill. Yeah, no way we're gonna get that combat right. Yeah, no. Yes, sir. No combat here. And the is gonna take that first game. One to zero. Even Govgang saving the cane for the last round doesn't help. And going to be Mateus, like you said, picking up game number one there. Get strapped in for this set, guys, because it's going to be an exciting one, it seems. We're going into game number two right now. We'll we see. will see if the stage makes any difference there. But yeah, interesting game. There was a lot of movement actually from Mateus' end and you know, Get ready for the next I think battle. that came in very useful a lot against this Leroy. Yeah. And we are back on Secluded again. We really like Secluded on game two, huh? The random yeah. select really giving us this. Classic. Okay. 
Gonna be the pickup and to the wall. Uh, full damage. Very solid there. Oh, big wave Ooh, good though. Spacing. Yeah. Good float there from Gov Gang. It's gonna be to the breakable wall, but can't get it off, unfortunately. You can see they were trying for it. Now the heat activated. Smash. Lock there. Ooh, even better parry. <laughs> Both players the flash coming out there. Ooh, nicely done from Mateus to pick up round number one there. Yep, one zero. Not bad. And there it is. Yep. Let's set up that full crash low, right? Full launch. Uh, 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 uh. Uh, uh. I love that Oki so much, by the way. That's like probably one of my favorite animations. The purple mist. Going to get the launch. I'm going to heal up a lot of gray health here. Goes for the cheeky setup again. Not parry. Got those. Spin kick. Going to stop the pressure. Both still have heat available, and Govgang has a lot of gray life to heal up. Mateus has barely any. And there we go. That's going to be the round to Govgang. Nice damage. Almost half life lost here already. Oh my days! Huge man. That does so much damage. But the heat burst coming through. Gonna be sending to the wall off of the heat dash. Good stuff. Ooh, spinning away. Mateus has been using these spins to absolute perfection, I have to say. And it is gonna be the one jab picking up the round. Yep, so uh, set point now. Just needs one more round, and uh, that will do it. First. Oh, Float. We're taking a trip to the wall. Hey, look at the damage. Yes, now the low check for the Yoki. And the launch again! Oh no, Gov Gang! This is looking bad, and yes, will get picked up off of the get up option. And that will be Mateus moving on. Yep. 2 0 oh, there, taking over Gov Gang. And that means Mateus will be moving on to play against O'Hara in Losers Round 7. Yeah. Been a while since we last saw uh, O'Hara. Mm -hmm. Alright, but uh, first we are going to have that mirror that we talked about earlier. It's going to be yes. Yali and it's going to be FF. Also, what's good, Van Dyne? A tournament's going well. Unfortunately, a Twitch. Or my stream, I don't know what it is exactly. Something is having issues, so the stream is buffering yes. constantly. It's kind of rough. <laughs> I feel like it's gotten a bit better, but it's still like on life support, probably. Yeah. Likely. Also, we still have 19 codes left to be claimed, which is mm -hmm. uh, a shame. You can go and do it right now, just while we're waiting to get into this game. But FF and Yali are both in the lobby, so... We'll be getting into this one with maximum efficiency, of course. Yeah. It's generally so weird because, again, like in OBS, usually it would say something, but it says like no drop frames. It's running perfectly smooth. Yeah, then it's probably the Twitch servers then. Uh... Yeah. The issue is, right, normally, well, if it was right before top eight, I should have done that. So we had like just a top eight vote. I don't want to. Mm. Do like, uh, you know, splice them together, really. Uh, yeah. <laughs> but um, I, I can manually change server, but it requires me to restart the stream. So yes, too much. yeah. Thank you, Van Dyne. Did they make a post about it? Uh, oh, oh, you watched the stream, the I guess. Oh, well, there you sense. go. But there you are. Like you said, the Lings coming out in full force this week. With FF and Yali. Round one. Fight. Okay. Here we go. Low check's coming out. Okay, AOP. 
Not too much damage off of that. But you can see these two are playing very differently to what you would usually play uh, against the Link, just because they're so wary of each other, knowing each other's options here. Yeah. Ooh, okay. getting the launch. The launch. Gonna be the spike with the heat burst. Oh, just heat smash, yeah. No, ch no check though, coming through, gonna pick up the round on Oki there. First round goes to FF. Nice. Go. Big launch. Uh. Uh, solid damage as well. Look at that. That's just a... Oh, uh, Yeesh. Yeesh, yeah. Look at this. FF just running a train right now. Ready, fight. Good low block, and that's going to be a full launch. FF yeah, with the optimal right punish. Now. Yeah. He's gonna get the spike off of the sidewall. And the low as well. It happened twice to Yali. It's gonna be a problem. And the seven golden letters. Oh my FF with a no round bound. Yep. And uh, you know, we saw Yali do work uh, in the mirror before, but FF ish. Mm. Yeah. Cooking. I also want to ask FF if uh, that character custom is a Higurashi reference because I feel like it's a Higurashi reference. Well, FF is old, so it, it tracks it tracks <laughs> old ass anime, you know. Round one, fight. Okay, here we go. Okay, back yeah, let's dashes. see. Low block, gets parried. The steady coming through. The low's coming out in full force in game number two. And the launch gonna be picking it up to the wall we go. Reset the splat. Uh, uh. Yeesh, man, look at that. Running in. And man, FF, are you seeing this? Yeah. Up one round. Can I be honest? I feel like Yali is actually playing too slow. Yeah. Yali enjoyed doing uh, all those big launches earlier on, and now is like playing a bit slower against FF, trying to play a bit more pokey. When That's... you know those big launches were working out earlier. That's one thing about FF is he's just like 100% offense go right, and that's yeah. very good in this game for sure. Oh yeah. But the thing is, right, if you keep defending, that is uh, going to be rough in the long run, especially against oh, a character yeah. like Ling, right? So many good tools on offense. You're just going to get mixed to death. And, uh, that's what we're currently seeing here. Hypnotist. Ali's cool. still alive. But the Before it goes on Vulcan. Yeah, a second perfect for FF. Oh, he engager, okay, Yali with the advantage and a good parry to boot. Not pretty much nice. There we go, the flow. There we go. We start something neat. This is exactly what I want to see from Yali. Those first two rounds, I think, playing a bit too slow, but this is exactly what I want to see from Yali. This is how they're going to win the game. Yeah. And uh, there we go. She ties it up. It's two to two. And FF respond here. Coming through, oh my! Yeah, that's gonna pick up for a combo. To the hey. wall we go, gonna spike down. But lost that damage. Oh lost my days. Just needs a heat engager here to get a lot of life back. Can't get the armor now. The two low life spins away into your own doom, and F F takes out Yali. Two to zero. FF taking that one, to be fair, I don't want to say swiftly, but it felt so swift. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. And uh, yeah, that means we are down to our last losers match before we get into our losers, uh, uh, winners final, sorry. Uh, it's mm -hmm. going to be Mateos up against O'Hara.
Wow, our second and third seed today, meeting in losers. Yep. A bit earlier than expected. Of course, uh, you'd expect those uh, second and third seeds to meet in uh, losers finals, of course, but... Um, Honestly, in this game, I'm not expecting yeah. anything. I can, yeah, maybe, yeah, <laughs> I can maybe hit like... The, if I hit like semi consistent with top 16, I'm happy, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, of course, yeah, yeah, yeah. Are we still using uh, the spreadsheet? <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, I'd love to see it. Oh, but, yeah. Yeah, you can see. Especially now that they are, uh, I think they're removing modding from the game, right? So you can't even oh, wow. maybe use the potato mod to fix the game. Because I know uh, Ratch, uh, you can maybe ask Ratch about it, because Ratch has some. Uh, Currently uses some mods to so just remove some details from some stages, so you know his his bad graphics card can do it. Mm. Interesting stuff. But again, while we're waiting, we still have 19 codes on the match arena. We are exceptionally close to $60, in which uh, the top three players will get a payout. So. Please do go on there, claim a code for 25 cents. It is, of course, completely free to do. Um, five codes away, so chat. Five codes. That's just five people. We have how many? 80 people in chat. You can even do it from your phone, you know? Yes. Quite easy. Um, you know, once you click the link, you get to this page right here. And uh, yeah, you can just uh, press claim code. You have to log in, obviously. You can use a lot of uh, different accounts, you know, as long as you only claim one a code per person. I, you know, say, why not use your Twitch, right? You're just, uh, you know, you're just watching on Twitch right now. Might as well. Uh, thank you, yeah. Minearm. Thank you, Datsu, Innocent Maiden. Uh, Neku, of course, that huge donation. Cooler Guy, G Wolf, again, huge donation. Uh, there we go, Van Dyne. Thank you, thank you. Yeah. There we go. Getting closer, that right? Three more coats, yep. and we have 60 bucks in the price pool. Yeah. That'd be pretty nifty. And with that being said, we have Ohava and Mateus both in the lobby. GLHFs put in the chat, and we will be going into this game right here. Oh man. So, ask you uh, play uh, Asuka yourself. Yes. How do you how do you feel about uh, Yoshi Asuka? Get Honestly, it's battle. not too bad. Like mm -hmm. generally, I, I don't think there's anything matchup specific where I'm like, oh god. You know, I'm I'm not quite sure of his like if you can get any big punishes on like your back three, for instance. So it's not a matchup where I'm, where I'm feeling too bad. Uh, Asuka does have a lot of moves that are like her tracking in general is poor, but she has some moves that have very, very good tracking. A bit on the slow side, but you can use it to kind of call out his spin. And uh, of course, you know, she has a lot of plus frames, so you can uh, always try and fade out the uh, ooh, flash. I see, yes. Now, just moving in. Ohava with the buff. Yeah. And of course, because of his uh, his stance, you can see his, his left leg is kind of forward. Yes. It's uh, a bit easier to connect with like a uh, run up, uh, down one plus two, stuff like that. Just because of his uh, hitbox, and that will kill right there. Look at the damage! Poking going on, turn taking. That's big. Oh, that's so huge. Okay. Now just some movement in the neutral. And that's going to be big right there with that combo starter. They're going to get the buff up while trying to push forward for the Yoki, but going to take a lot of damage doing so. Yeah. Rage up, that's going to connect. Yeah. Oh no! One jab! Fortunate there. Wow. 
I saw the move, I, and I was like, I don't know what move it is, but it's probably going to connect. Yeah, didn't though. And, uh, yeah. I need some Mateos now in the lead, back three whipping. There we go, the running in. Getting that back 2-2. Two, two. Such a good move. Especially now that it's a heat engager. Yep, and that's going to be the heat dash combo for a ton of damage there. Yeah. The flash going to pick up. Oh, it doesn't pick. It does pick up the kill. Okay, yeah, I forgot he, about the he goes, he goes for the flare right in the combo. He goes yeah. for the cool combo. I just picked that. Yeah. I oh, forgot I about the second hit there. But good range finding from Mateus right now, I think. You know, uh, ranging out well. And can. Okay. Yeah. Gonna be the setup for the buff there, and the slidey coming through. Good now, just being careful. Get some health there. Oh, oh no! Okay. Missed whiffs. Gets a little punish. That's gonna be the flash, and that might be dead. No, okay. Good blow. Lo low block, sorry. But the trade is going to pick up game number one for Mateus. Yep. It was now in the lead. One to zero. Mm -hmm. Yo, and we got uh, Mishkin claiming code. Wim, what's good, Wim? Hello, hello. Ciao, Wim. Couldn't be with us this week, unfortunately. Yeah. But let's get into this game get number two. For the next battle. And it will be on Arena this time around. Something different from Training Ground on game two, finally. <laughs> Oh, that's supposed to be a uh, Caroline, I think. Yeah. Um, yeah. Uh, is, that's, is it Caroline? I feel like it's something else, right? Um, it looks like Caroline. <laughs> that, or maybe it's because she's called like a different in, in Danish. Maybe, yeah. Is it's the it's the yellow raincoat that that yeah, 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 like, yeah. does it for me? Um, okay, here's the pickup. Two the wall we go. Uh. No. Oh wow, flip over. But good stop there. Had to do that. You best cancel. The low check. Gonna pick up the round. For O'Hara. Do you mean what's with the link? It's just a uh, second 10. It's a 10th second tournament. Yeah, double digits now. Yeah. But good spin out from Mateus and has been utilizing those really well so far this tournament. But that's gonna be back turn. She threw a little float there. Getting to the wall. Uses the buff immediately. That's gonna be to the wall again. Oh yeah, look at the fresh of the Mohara. Wants to stay in this set. Hey, hey. There we go, Mateos obviously. You wanna end it right here, right now if he can. He's not oh, yes. wanna extend it out. Mohara, very dangerous player to get going. Good stop there. That's going to be the side wall. Good sidestep out from Ohara there. Okay, the heat burst didn't stop the pressure. Much needed. Good block on the heat smash and spins out. Now has Ohara at the wall. Going to have to use heat smash now. Does oh, so. the counter hit. That's going to be it. And that is one, one Ohara. And that's the no round brown. Throw Harbor there as well, and it's gonna be one piece, like you said. Your one piece, can we get much higher? So high. We are do 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 do. <laughs> Yo ho ho. All right. So uh, Man. we are all tied up right here, and uh, it was looking very good. Obviously, first game right for, for Mateos, the and then battle. second game was just. All Ohara. Okay, Urban Square. We're moving into this one now. Urban Squabin. Urban Squabin. 
Right. Same outfit. Yo, this is the winning outfit, you know. It's yeah, probably. winning outfit. The, this is one thing that I think I've talked about in Salty EU, but I like preset changes because I think yeah. it resets your mental while still playing the same character. For me, I have my loser's bracket costume and my uh, my winner's yeah. bracket costume. You know, like, I pick one, yeah. I run with it, and when I lose, go to loser's bracket, it's, it's a new one. Yeah. New player, new me, new custom. Yeah. Oh, nice float with a one jab, though. Not going to be too much damage, but it's going to be solid enough punish to get to the wall. The grab gets broken there. The smash coming through. Going to keep up the pressure. Good spin out. Much oh, needed. Another, no, doesn't get the follow up there. That's sometimes a little bit tricky. But 10 one seconds jab left. Jabs alone. Like, oh, huge life. Doesn't have time. Yeah, really didn't have time there. I don't think he didn't have time even if he got a combo, right? It's it, it, hard to say, hard to say. Could get a lot of damage in that situation, right? So, yeah. And a lot of damage really fast in this uh, Tekken 8 after all. Oh yeah, of course. Now, good side step around for Mohara and the grab. Gonna go unbroken there. And the Can Can going to be picking up the combo there. Down good, at yes, the we can, can. Ugh. Side walls. Pick up a lot of damage. And another can, can. Double up on that. And that's what we can, can do. And another. Three for the show. Throw Harbor there. And the grab again, but gets broken that time. Ooh. Oh my days. It's going to be a solid amount of damage here for the Mateus on at the wall. Full clean wall splat. But the low block from Ohio. Wait a second. Oh, Spence. The heat right there. Still in rage, though. Just inching yes. forward. Oh. Goes for the parry. Doesn't work. Good block. Oh! oh. oh. And just like the that. Speed up. <laughs> The speed up at the end, and Ohara takes it with a second no round round. Yes, yeah, speed up ag activated right there, and uh, that means we are now going to take a trip to our winner's final. First first to three of the day. It's going to be uh, Fran up against uh, Schizophrenic69. So again, we got a lot of uh, Yoshi representation mm -hmm. in this debate, I feel like. Yes, absolutely. Bandai Namco did the uh, domain expansion there. Connection issues. Domain expansion. Yep. <laughs> Stream exploded again. Um, oh no. Well, I don't think there's any solution apart from me restarting the stream and changing yeah. this Twitch server, but the issue is it's going to create two VODs and I'm too lazy to merge the two VODs together. <laughs> I'll just say it out loud. I guess. It's a me issue. I just, oh man. Like well, if I... to be fair, when it comes up in the VOD, it probably won't have all the buffer. So no, it won't. It won't. Be, yeah, should be fine on the VOD. Yeah, because again, it's like it's so weird. Uh, it's like the, the weirdest thing, right? That it's just perfectly fine on uh, all like my OBS metrics, mm. and there's usually no issues, and it's exact same setup, right? Um, yeah. So I'm assuming. It's something like whatever, like, um, like server wide issue. Mm. Very likely. Which, which sucks because I haven't had this issue like for a long time. Um, mm. but I have had it once before, like, um, when, when you had to choose your own server, now OBS just uh, does it automatically. Um, mm. yes. but I think. Probably the automatic server right now is having a. It's, I, I assume it's getting overloaded because of the big CSGO tournament or something. Yes. It's still playing right now. But the, 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 the thing the, also is that some of my friends are streaming also from Denmark and they have no issues. Yeah. I think. I mean, I think it's around the time to stream. I think it's like peak streaming time anyway. Yeah, but normally it's still no issues, right? So. Yeah. 
I mean, there's a lot of esports going on right now, so yeah. we'll, we'll see. I think it's RLCS also happening, so. Too bad. Too bad. I'm not sure if OWCS is happening. I think that happened in the morning. I'm not sure, though. Um. And there's not really... Mm -hmm. much I can do. Yeah, I'm fortunate. But it, it just makes me think that I should probably, uh, just to make sure, not run an automatic for the uh, stream stuff. I should yeah. choose like a server and just uh, run on that server. Mm. Likely the solution, isn't it? So we're just waiting on Fran here. Um, Schizophrenic is uh, on their way. Let's see, do I have Fran? I feel like I have Fran on my. No, I do. Sounds list, yeah. Okay, so. <laughs> Schizophrenic, of course, another Yoshimitsu, so like you said earlier. Um, Quite a lot of y Yoshimitsu love uh, coming out today. Yeah. And we know Flan can uh, play multiple characters, so it will be dependent on what they decide. <laughs> yep, we'll see, right? Um, and uh, we'll see if we can get one more code claim chat, please. Yes. We just need one more. We have one more code. That that's gonna make it sixty bucks in a price pool. Mm -hmm. Yes, you know, very nice. Reminder also that um, if you wanna watch these streams, um, watch the replays and not have it buffer, we actually yes. do have a YouTube channel. It's right there um, where you can find all the previous vods from all our Tekken tournaments uh, on there. There's a lot of good content to to watch. We also have a Guilty Gear Strive, Guilty Gear Excerpt. Um, we have, uh, you know, some DNF duel on there if you're into that. Ooh. Blaze Blue, Central Fiction, you know, pretty much any modern fighting game you can find there. Street Fighter 6. Um, we post a lot of tournaments, so, you know, there's a uh, yeah. lot of stuff to find. I highly recommend checking out the YouTube, and uh, if you haven't, you can catch up on some salty EU lore for some of these players. Uh, yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> but Flan in the lobby right now. Yeah. That's good. Frannick is saying uh, needed a minute. That's been a minute now, so hopefully <laughs> it'll be here in a sec. Bah, bah. Yeah, I mean, all, always good to take some time, you know, before you're back again. Grab some water, you know, uh, toilet or whatever. You just don't get it mixed. Don't grab some toilet water, you know. Yeah, yeah. Don't, don't mix it up. That being said, I am going to the mix-up this year. I've officially booked my hotel, so right. very, very excited to to head to the mix-up this year. I don't know if I'm going to go to the mix-up, but I haven't really decided yet about the uh, the French tournaments. But uh, definitely, I'm going to go to Brussels Challenge, and I'm going to go mm -hmm. to Install as well in two weeks. There you go. Which reminds me, I need to sign up for Install still. <laughs> yeah, get get your start GG in. <laughs> yeah, definitely. So it's going to be some uh, some busy weeks of uh, traveling for me for sure. Oh um, yeah, for sure. Busy month. I also really want to go to um, what's it called? Uh, to only the best. It's in Turin uh, this year. Yeah, uh, yeah. Which uh, I think is supposed to be a lot nicer than Naples. So okay. I mean, I'm uh, ready I'm to get zero points as well. You can yeah, get some yeah. dojo points, uh, Gara. Yes. For sure. Um, sure, dojo points. I remember mm -hmm. one year I was like, I was strangely high on um, that's true, Ohara. Nicer than Naples is not not hard. It's like saying nicer than Birmingham. <laughs> <laughs> it's like Birmingham, but with really good food. Uh, I like. 
the thing is, I can't say anything. I live in the UK. I'm in, and I'm in Birmingham, like quite a lot of the time for for tournaments. So, no way. Have you uh, been on? Much. Have you tried uh, Shell Garage then? The yes, thing? I have. The of best. course, I have. Oh, oh man. Okay, but we're getting into this winners' finals. Remember, it is a best of five, first to three, however you want to call it. Schizophrenic versus Than, and we will be starting with the Zafina again. Obviously liable to switch to the Leo and the Mist! Wall damage there, and we've got the floor on one hit as well. Yes, downstairs we go, and the Than are going to be picking up the combo. Ooh, nicely done from Schizophrenic! That's going to pick up a lot of damage there. To the wall we go. Yep, that's going to be it. Round two. Fight. Okay, one jab. Three. One checks again. And the launch. But it's because if that can't get the full combo, unfortunately. Oh. I will say today we have seen quite a few combo drops. Just in general. Yeah, very good. Down. See, the thing is, right, I always like allowing customs and stuff like that. Ooh. It looks sweet. Oh, oh try it again! Oh, not this time. You're not getting away with that. Yeah, yeah uh -oh. I went for the Spooku again. But that, that was a great um, sidestep movement, sorry, lateral movement. Thumb schizophrenic. Good patience oh. from Fan and gets the full launch. Good stuff there. That's interesting. I, I don't think I've ever seen like people getting that good of a punish on that. I, I guess it's yeah. because Safina kind of went under his sword, right? Uh, you just need to know the timing. It's not even about uh, getting the sword. It's over. But that's going to be a lot of the grey health back. No! Oh, the mist is active things, but doesn't get the combo off of it, but still gets the round. Yeah, caught down right here. And uh, it is... And now, loner, struggling. No my more brains. My, my brain. Yeah, I did that earlier as well. You're fine. <laughs> but going underneath it. Beautiful wall rising launcher there from Fan. Half life now here. Ooh, big whiff. No whiff punish. I do. Ooh, that's the heat engager. And the launch! And all the grey health healed up. Yeah. Okay. That's interesting. And now heat activation on both sides. Rage on both sides. Couldn't be any more tense here. Good block. Yeah. Oh, oh no, Fran in the no. deficit. What? Ish. Okay. Yeah, I went for the helicopter, but uh, Than was obviously in knockdown and a bit too far away, so got a flea punish on that one there. Nice. A lot of damage. Yes, nice combo. And the Yoki takes it under half health. That does so much chip. And we get the speed up. I think that was an Azuna drop at the end as well. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, the, the rainbow drop, I think. Yeah. Went for yeah, yeah. yeah, rainbow drop to kill. Yeah, yeah. Rainbow drop. Yeah. That's some old lore you don't know about. Uh, Salty Rainbow Drop. Right. We'll be heading into game number two. Let's see if uh, Fan will switch character because did switch to the Leo last time. Crowleg claiming a code, which means we are now at $60, everyone. And there we go, Ice. You said earlier that the Alyssa was in the back pocket and is finally showing up to play now. Thumb yeah. fan here. Yeah, first time we see it right this time. Round one. Fight. Oh man, here we go. To the wall we go. Ooh! Drops it. Tries to go for a setup actually. Went for that setup before. So that's an intentional drop, I think, to go for that setup. But that setup at the wall always hits me and it hits fan there as well. And that's going to be the first round to Schizophrenic. Yeah, going up one, two, zero. Okay. The flash! 
And the worst part is, right, if you, if you lose here, that's a good chance you might be against another Yoshi and lose yeah, this exactly. Look at the damage, man! This Alyssa hasn't been able to pop a single move, I don't think. No. There we go. Heat Engager sets it up. But there's a launch. Yes, there you go. Fan very consistent with that one. Okay, big damage here from Fan. Finally showing us the Alyssa. Good side step out from Schizophrenic though. And now has Fan at the wall. This is a very dangerous situation here. Ooh, the heat smash. Going to pick up the round. Yep. And... Um... First round, but still got to win two straight here. And that is just to make it even, right? Can't force to lose this yes. one because if you go down 2-0, that is very, very rough. Man, I I think Schizophrenic should stop using that, but we've seen Fan is so consistent at launch punishing that move. Yeah. Okay. Jabs out, good fight out of the wall there from Fan. Sets up the mist and the grab counter hit as well. Rainbow drop. That's going to be the three rounds needed to pick up game number two. Yeah. And uh, age old question, who wins? Ninjas or robots? Ninjas. Yes. <laughs> for today, for today. <laughs> no. We might see another character switch from Stan, by the way. This could be to the Leo. Yeah, it could, right? But... All back I mean, to the Zach. I wonder, I, re I really do, like... What you do, you swap to Alyssa, right? And you just get completely blown out the water. Mm -hmm. I genuinely do wonder. Yeah, it's first to three. It's first to three. Yeah. Uh, it is the winner's finals, of course. Schizophrenic doing a, maybe a Washige. What are you standing up for? <laughs> uh oh, he's popping off. <laughs> Iris, don't worry about it. Uh, uh? I mean, I, I'm sure Robots is in there somewhere, you know? Yeah, man. Androids versus Robots? I mean. Uh, I'm so. Uh, I'm, I'm pretty sure Samurai Jack destroyed some robots. There we go. Well, it's a Samurai. I mean. Ah. Samurai against battle. robots, you know. All right, back to Safina we go, saying I had enough of Alisa. Okay. Yeah, back and to now we get the I... the age old, you know, fortune tellers against ninjas. Yeah, I did say it would be another character switch, and it is back to the Zaf. I do prefer this to switch to the Leo because obviously you have already played Safina in this set. So you're a bit more warmed up on that character instead of having to play three different characters over the course of the set. Yeah. And plus, if you do win this, you're character locked. So like, you don't. I, I'm not sure if you necessarily want to be character locked to the Leo, right? Yeah. Okay. So. Good job. Goes out, grab whiffs. Ooh, the floaty float. And that's gonna be to the wall and the round. Yeesh. Okay, first round. Ooh, Fine. the mist. Goes in a lot of trouble. Yeah. Okay. Nice float. Ooh, nice float. Yeah. So check. At the wall in between two walls here. This is dangerous. But the rainbow drop coming through here. Stuck in the corner though. But again, you have that spin. Such a good get out of jail free card. Just like that, right? And Schizophrenic is very good at use, using it, I have to say. Has got out of a lot of situations utilizing that spin. But you need to be careful of the health at this uh, health bar as well in Mage. And that is going to be Fan picking up round number two. Yep. Oh, such a long road ahead still. We have seen this before, right? But Fran really needs to get some agency. Yes. And the flash. So dangerous. 
sure on now. Yeah, that's gonna be big. Heat engage up. Uh -huh. Oh no, but look at the damage. Yo, Rayshard? Locked! No, full block, and that's gonna be the round. Schizophrenic. Good launch punish on the Rage Art there. Uh, Philippines and Hungary. Okay, low check coming through. Over the top. Oh, down There's the launch! Two. Oh no! Drops it again! Yeah, he spins out of there. Beyblade, Beyblade, let him rip! Spinning away again! But, yeah, that's gonna connect and that's gonna be the round, the game and the set for Schizophrenic. Moving on to the grand finals and win his side. Yeah, 3-0. Yeah, Fran is uh, from Korea originally, but they uh, requested to have the Hungarian flag. So, I guess uh, that's where they live currently. Who am I to say no? Oh, wait, I forgot. Matthias, of course, out. Yes. So, we only have uh, one Yoshi left. There we go. Yeah, that means we are going to go. And this is a classic match, you know. Mm -hmm. FF has some experience. Uh, he's played against me hundreds of times. So hopefully, he should know the Asuka matchup a little bit. Against Ohara. Okay. Yeah. Well, I, I do like uh, Justy. Uh, you were from the Dominican Republic originally, right? I, I think so. I remember correctly. I think it's it's cool to represent where you're from, like originally. Um, where your roots or whatever. Um, I'm. Pretty much cool with whatever people want. As flax. Yeah, yeah. It's just really whatever you prefer. Some people, uh, like Pika, if you know Pika, like switches flax like every time. Like sometimes he's yeah. Bel Belgium, sometimes he's Spanish, other times he's uh, from Puerto Rico. I'm not Cuba, Cuba, Cuba. Yeah. It kind of swaps around a little bit, but here we go, yeah. losers, semi finals. Of course. Ohara FF. We'll see what happens here. It's Czech Republic, Denmark. We will be going into this one with maximum efficiency. Do remember that this is a first to two and not Get a first to three. The next battle. Yeah. That is uh, crucial. So we're going to be starting off with a panda here. Round one. Is FF. Like three. Oh, we're just lubing. Yes, and we are on Midnight Siege, so some cartoons available. Yeah, so Ever plays uh, both Panda and Ling, and he usually picks whichever he feels the opponent like is worse in the matchup. In that makes sense. So if he feels like you know this player is really good against Panda, he will pick Ling, and uh, otherwise he will pick uh, you know Panda. But that will be round one going to FF there. Good side step away, and that's oh, gonna be yeah. oh wow. Yep, that can happen, unfortunately, especially against someone like Panda, it's kind of weird. Yeah, but a good low block and a launch anyway from O'Hara there, and it's going to be one apiece in the rounds. Round three. There is Van Dyne, there is a mod that just removes like some of the stage, that's not like fully potato, it just removes like some of the backgrounds in the lackey stages. Okay, sidestepping away, that's good stuff from O'Hara. Yeah, very but nice. Can, 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 can. Yes, sir. To the wall we go. Big damage here. Gonna get the spike down and the beast flat. Good throw, though. Wow. Get some life back here. Just a regular one. Uh oh. Okay. And this is. Yep, that's damage. Yep. Man, oh man. Okay, FF. 
Yep. Show them what for. And kind of, again, getting that Oki gimmick right on uh, Ohara, meaning uh, uh, Ohara might not know how to deal with that. Yes, absolutely. And it plays into mind games for later, of course, because now Ohara is thinking about it, and that's now part of the conditioning. It but this can can is becoming a part of the conditioning right here. Absolutely. Jabbing. Nice Texas throw. Okay, Three hunting blocks. Bear. Nice. Ooh, ooh, nice. Yes, absolutely. Stays down, gets hit. Doesn't commit oh, to the full spring. Oh, the throw. The Zen headbutt. Oh, there we go. And that's going to be the panda of of FF yep. picking up game number one there. Ohara, we did see Ohara, right? Uh, going down one against Mateos and then taking it back. I feel like Ohara, one of those players, you know, needs one match maybe to, uh, to download a little bit. Mm -hmm. To adjust, yes, of course. Yeah. Speaking of uh, download, is the stream still uh, imploding, I would say? Is it still running like absolute not great? <laughs> or is the stream running a little bit better? No. Before it was like buffering all the time for some reason. Get ready for the next battle. Let us know, chat. And while we're waiting for that, um, we are going to go into celebration on the scene. It's good. It's good. Okay. It's laggy. <laughs> oh, okay. I see. I do wonder if it's where you are watching from. Though. Likely. Okay. Low checks coming through. And again, another low check. To the wall is Ohara. Dangerous situation. But good fight out of there. Good damage as well to boot. And gonna get the Yoki. The Elizabeth here. KOF. Mm. Yep. Oh, nicely done. Yeah. Good stuff from Ohara there. Ready fight. Low check, gonna be starting off the round. Hang around each other. And FF gonna make the first engage. Yeah, it's gonna Thank chill. <laughs> oh no. No. Gimmicks bear initiated. Now. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, the hop kick stops the can can. The bear hug stops. damage here for the combo. Can't get the spike on the heat burst though. Oh, the heat smash and the rage Oh, shot. that's gonna connect. No. Oh no! Man, Tekken. Oh no. Okay, exactly the heat. Can't get the wall though. Hop kick. Launch. Can? No can do. Ooh, I like that mix from FF there. That's something that hasn't been shown yet. So overloading the opponent's mental stack or at least trying to there. The wall, nice. That tornado. Big Good damage here. Yet. Locks, but the low going to be picking up the rounds. Round oh, kick. nice launch on round start. Huge big read. Woo. And again. No, oh man, got hit by the setup. Nice. Oops. Keep her staying alive here. Cannot afford. To lose this one can can, can can and ohara ties it up one to one yes absolutely okay the elizabeth doing it yeah i mean an ff now has the opportunity to switch to the ling if needed yeah, that's, so it that's... seems like it's a PC issue rather than uh, yeah, anything else. That, that's a weird thing, right? Like, I have the stream open just to check always. Um, 
And my stream is, is buffering as well. Um, but again, that's the weird thing that I said. If I look in OBS, it says no drop frames, completely perfect connection. Round one. Yeah, I'm well switched to the Valma Ling. Yeah. Will FF here. And, and that Watch is, it it's a strength and a weakness, like right? double edged sword really. If he loses, oftentimes like game two, he will swap characters in game three. And honestly, it's oftentimes not paying off for him. Um, so I would always say to him, like, you need to just stick to a character, stick to his gut, you know? Yeah. Very good. Low track coming through. I mean, obviously, against maybe someone like uh, Ohara, who tends to be. He, he tends to be like a uh, slow starter. Swapping character, you know, is a bit better, maybe, right? Yeah. Because they need to readjust, right? Yeah. yeah. He, he's more susceptible to kind of losing that first game. Okay, to the wall we go. Big damage there. Oh, yeah. Oh, man, yeah. Good low block, though. Gonna get the protect punish. And the snake edge to the wall. Activating the rage up. Gotta get rid of the grey health. Yeah. We've seen FF likes doing this. Yeah, makes sense, right? Again, now we're like one mix away from killing. We can see why you would want to do it. Ooh. Yeah, the heat smash gonna come through and pick up the round there for FF. Set. Point. FF. Back dashing away. Oh yeah, that's dangerous now. To the wall we go. Gonna activate the heat first. Can't get the spike though there. He dash. Gets a little bit of extra damage. Good low block though. And a good punish and fights their way out of the wall with a heat burst. Last frames, but no again. Gets launched by the rat. Eight. One hit away, Ooh, yeah. good block, good the low block. Oh! That's it. Denmark, number one. FF. Moving on. And they will be playing against Flan, of course, in the losers finals. Yeah, that's good. It's good as an F. Uh, Thancher, kind of yes. Like, I used to actually participate in uh, in my own tournaments um, in the past, but the issue is that there's simply too many players. It's like, such a, yeah. you know, good issue to have. There's just too many players for me to realistically <laughs> sign up and play. Um, because yeah. if I do sign up and play, uh, you're going to have all my matches right on stream, uh, first of all. I probably have to DQ if I get to losers to avoid, like, way too many of my matches on stream. I have to do TO stuff in the background with all these players, um, make sure everything runs smoothly. I need to have enough commentators maybe because uh, so I don't have to commentate my own games. Um, so it's like, yes, I would like to play, but it's this other tournaments I can join. Yes. The fact that I don't have the time to join other tournaments, that's the stinky part, that's, right? That's <laughs> the hard part, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but that, that's besides the point. But we will be going into this next one with Than coming in. Yeah. The hungry man. Fran, let's go. Hungry for the win. Yeah. Um but yeah. Wow, wow, wow. Wow, wow, wow. Yeah, second P we do have two PCs. That's not the issue. Like the issue is yeah. who's gonna, you know, TO and <laughs> commentate while I play. Yeah. Because I have done that before, but that was just extremely stressful having to run back and forth. Yeah. And having like someone like uh, Michelle was like on my PC running the stream and that's like not fair to her as well. With the best Nordic player, mm. Mm. Joe Pilix maybe, Whale. I don't know if Whale is the best Nordic still. He's definitely the best Danish player, but not about Nordic. I've got Dustiel, Jopelix, uh, J-Boy. Would Flower be up there? 
the Emperor Sui. Flower, yes, but I think uh, a bit below those I mentioned. Okay. Really good, but maybe not like he's maybe like top 16, but not top 8. Also. Okay, yeah, I see. I see. From what I've seen so far in the game. The main man sweet, true top one. True, top uh, one. We also have. Um, I mean, there's a lot of really strong players. Oh yeah, for sure. You know, on a good day, I think I'm like top 16 in Denmark. <laughs> and there you go. There we go. Yeah, we have actually some really strong players uh, in Denmark that um, that don't really show up online and they don't show up for like outside of the the locals yeah nordic dbfc players i don't really know any anymore not gonna lie like i know you're like literally the only player i know it's like a trick wow. question it's like <laughs> i guess uh andre plays it i guess so you out of two you're, you're the best <laughs> there you go But yes, as we're waiting for um, Flan to come in, please feel free to check out the match arena. Of course, we still have 14 codes remaining. Let's get as much money as we can to the prize pool. Completely free to do. 25 cents for the prize pool. Literally, all you need to do is click claim code on the match arena and it will do it for you. I mean, Alexiad and Mianki and Pwncake don't really play. I guess Pwncake would be number one out of those you mentioned there. Mm. Um, and Mianki could be number one, I think. But I don't th know how much Mianki plays anymore. Alexiad primarily plays uh, Strive now, right? So At least Alexiad told me at Headstone, but they don't, they don't really play uh, TBFC anymore. Yeah. I mean, Thancher, you need to go to locals. We have the Danish Championship is going on right now. There you go. I'm to like uh, the Aarhus monthly, the Copenhagen uh, monthly tournament like qualifier. Um, you beat both of them? Hell yeah. There you go. Then you're probably the best one currently. But that's why I say you're the only one who actually regularly plays, I think. Mm. We also have um, the finals. It's going to be in Hanning. So if you're closer to Hanning, there's a uh, LC LCQ over there. So you can either go qualify through Aarhus, Copenhagen. We have an online qualifier as well. And we got Hanning LCQ. So that's like, uh, there you, go. you know, at least you can show up to the online uh, LCQ thing. That, that'd be nice. Yes. Absolutely. Just waiting for Fran to uh, join the lobby. Oh, Fran can find the lobby. And Horsens? I mean, isn't Horsens close to Hanning? Maybe I'm close to Aarhus as well. Uh, Alright. Uh, I, I was about to say, gotta restart the lobby, but. There, no, there we go. Flan's found it. We were playing hide and seek, but Flan is here. And now on the real account. Can you see? They changed it. They switched accounts. Yeah. Final boss. Final boss, yeah. Um, Actually, also, I think they have this uh, local in Fyn as well at Ulnse. I don't know if that's closer to Horsens. Than all who's this. Get Getting into this losers battle. final, and remember, we are back to first of three or best of five. I did, and it oh, and it will be the Jack Hates coming out this time. Yeah. Jack, fight! Van multi-character player here. Big damage here from FF, starting things off, but Van. Trying to fight back with the jack. Yes, does so well, and no, he comes through. Oh man, did you see the timing on all of these pokes? Yeah, just built up all the damage. And Jack, you know, even though Jack is not maybe the best character, you know, he can still be very strong, especially, you know, depends on how well the opponent knows the matchup really. Absolutely, yeah. Good low block there now. 
We're going to get to the wall. That isn't going to wall break because it's at a weird angle, but going to size up and get the wall break that time. We can get the balcony break as well, and we will. Look at the damage from FF. In back turn there. Got the robot and rage, but it's not working out. FF. In quick work. One to one here. <laughs> it stays in Art of Phoenix. Ooh, wow! The range on that incredible connects there. Okay. Yeah, just poking away at it. Van just catching all of FF's yeah. timings at the down minute and the two. launch. The classic Finna down forward 2 and Jack. <sighs> yep. Oh. That's going to be the cartoons. The Looney Tunes on TV. And, Mickey uh, Mouse out there smiling yeah. somewhere. Yeah. Okay. Oh, nice out of Phoenix there. Voids. The poke. Nice power push there from FF. Okay. Gain some Tekken, but good side step there from FF. Low checks, low checks! Oh my days, FF! And we're going to round number five in game number one. All tied up. Remember, this is a uh, run back from uh, winner's semis. It is. And took out FF 2 to 1. We'll start with the, um, we'll start with the Leo. I yes. forgot. It was Zafina the switch into the Leo, yes. Raid coming through. Okay, he gets up immediately. The low gets blocked, and that's the combo, and the round, and the game. You win. Alright, you win. Ran up now one to zero. And is character locked to the Jack, so we'll have to play Jack next game as well. Um, but FF, of course, can switch to the Panda if need be. So we'll see if that one happens. Get ready for the next No, battle. it will be sticking with the Ling Zhao Yu. And we're on secluded training ground again. It's always game two as well, you know. Yep. Okay. Here we go. The launch for Fan. It's gonna be solid damage here on the board. To the wall we go. Ugh. Huge. Diggy Burst is going to stop the pressure, and that's going to be the wall break. Oh my days, he dash. If that was a wall split, it would have been the game, but it's the round anyway. Round two. Fight. Okay. Out of Phoenix, Logos blocks, no punish. Go. Bon. Oh, yeah, that's one. another. Can you Jack see where that hit? Oh my days. FF in a lot of trouble here. Yes, absolutely. No. Pick up. Nice knockdown again. Gets the Yoki. This is a no round round for Fan with the Jack 8. Which means we are going into a game three and FF will need to reverse sweep to try and get into grand finals. Absolutely. Give me one second. Uh, I'll be right back just getting a drink real quick um, before we potentially start grand finals. One sec. Of course, I, I will be uh, the voice you're listening to for a little bit. But we are heading into this game right now. Getting ready for the match and getting ready to spectate. Get Again, like I said, FF could battle. be switching and it will be the switch to the Panda versus the Jack 8. 
But remember, if Than wins this, uh, sorry, if FF wins this, they are character locked to Panda for the rest of the set. So, they are choosing to commit to Panda here. To the wall we go, big damage. Grab, not gonna get broken. That's gonna be a seven golden letters for the Panda. Seems to be working out. Okay. There's the launch from Fan though. I'm gonna say you're not gonna run away with it right now. No break because of the side wall there. I'm afraid you're gonna stop some of the pressure hunting bear. The low gonna get stuffed out by the heat burst. And a good duck there. Now, just some turn taking. Going on stays out of range. Gonna activate the Heat Smash. Gonna get the grab off as well. That's not gonna kill, but the Oki will. It's 2-0 for okay. Going to be the trade. The Slidey gets blocked and punished from Flan. Gonna go all the way to the wall, but no wall splat. Low check. Good low block from Fan, and that's going to put a round on the board. Fight. Um, jab, jab, turn, take, attack, and coming through. Just good pressure, good poking. Just mixing up the timing as well, so FF gets hit, delaying some of them. You can see this game is a lot slower. No launchers yet in this one, just all pokes. Okay, spin kick next. It's gonna be the heat burst stopping the pressure. The rage art, no, that's gonna get blocked for sure. And gonna punish it with the heat smash and it's now two apiece. Must win for FF. Than goes to grand finals if they win this round here. The launch, gonna pick up a solid amount of damage and send to the wall, but it's not going to get the wall's flat damage. Just out of range there. Need to activate the plus flames. Heat burst, more plus flames. Heat burst back, making sure there's no advantage on the board for Than here. Okay. Back turn. Oh, this is at the wall, this is dangerous. The heat smash coming through for the chip damage. Oh. Oh. Enraged. Oh! Panic oh. can do so much damage. But that That's will gonna be, be it. That's what yes. we're forgetting about the uh <laughs> in the chat. Uh, I hope they fix that. Uh turn it to like the old ways where you didn't have to manually close down the chat every time. Yeah. Yeah. It does suck. But Flan will be moving on to Grand Finals. Yeah. Guys, nice. uh, I'm sure if you're brand new thrilled, you might even say it's fantastic. Um, <laughs> I, you could have laughed a little bit more. Uh, I, I tried, man. Okay, <laughs> that's just how I laugh. <laughs> um, but yes, on to Grand Finals now. That's gonna be that Yoshi, right? The beat Fran 3 0 last time. Definitely nothing to scoff at here. Um, it's gonna be interesting. Satanic. Yes. And also, good news for FF. They will get a part of the prize pool as we are over $60 on the Matcherino. But we still have 12 codes remaining. So if you want a little bit more going to these top three players, please do claim a code for completely free on the Matcherino, 25 cents get added to the prize pool and it literally costs you nothing. So yep. please do that. Absolutely. Yeah, if you uh, want to qualify for Wanted, you have to win. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, as I'm saying, as I've said earlier, next month, um, in a couple weeks, we're going to announce something very exciting. I'm sure the Tekken players will uh, be happy about. And, I'm very uh, excited. 
Hopefully they they will. If they if they're not happy, then I don't know. <laughs> I know I'm excited at the very least. Yeah. Then then I might cry a little bit, you know. I might not show it on stream, but I'll lift oh, oh, no, the no, 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 don't do that. Bit. Manly no, tears, yeah, though, manly tears. But... <laughs> show, show it on stream, man. I'm, I'm sure everybody will love it. Yeah. But now I hope also uh, that means whoever I've planned that we'll get some um, some extra players we don't normally see. I think I yes. might entice them to join. Mm -hmm. be, be interesting. Uh, if that also, by the way, that's going to go for all games. It's not just for Tekken. Oh, wow. If you're a Guilty Gear player, uh, look forward to some uh, Guilty Gear Strive announcement and Exode announcement uh, coming there as well. There you go. Exciting times. Exciting times. But yes, we are just waiting for Schizophrenic to join the lobby. Remember, Fan does have to play Thumb Losers. So we'll have to win two sets in a row in order to win uh, Salty EU this week and yep. win the majority of the prize parts and get the wanted qualifier. Goes to play in that final uh, top four on Tuesday automatically. Yeah. It's going to be uh, interesting. Because uh, finally, and I know Spag is going to be happy about that. It's not going to oh. be a, uh, it's not going to be Asusena winning Soldi. Not, not Asusena, yeah. It's been a while. Let's be yeah. real. It's definitely been a while since Asusena. Yeah, it has won, been a while, so. yeah. But I feel like when Asusena didn't win, it's been Yoshi. Yeah, I mean, uh, there was a lot of. Uh... A lot of that last time on, uh, not last time on Wanted, it was I think two weeks ago on Wanted. Yeah. Um, that there was uh, Yoshi Azu, Yo Yoshi Azu as the first two games. But Schizophrenic in the lobby now, so we will be getting into this grand finals. Remember, Schizophrenic on the winner's side only needs to win one first of three, and Flan needs to win. Two first of threes in a row in order to take home the racket. Yep, and let's get into it right now. Than does obviously have the ability to uh, switch characters as we've seen multiple times throughout this tournament. Schizophrenic stays true to the Yoshi uh, character specialist or the character main. Ready for the next battle. But it will be starting off with the Jack 8, which I don't think Schizophrenic has seen yet. So uh, that's going to be a change. Yep. Um, so we pretty much have tried all characters in uh, yep. Franz Bagger Tricks, uh, apart from the Jack. Ale yes, I think the Alyssa one will play this. Uh, did, did play Alyssa as well. Oh, did play Alyssa, yeah. sorry. That's true, only Asusina and Yoshi have one soul. Oh my god, perfect. There you go. Starting it off. Was it the Leo that wasn't played? Against Skitsu. That's true. It might have been the Leo. There you go, that's what I was thinking of. I mean, Yoshi has won a lot of soldiers, so it wouldn't surprise me. Ooh, okay. The miss coming through. Skitsu really does like using that miss, that mid range, just because it's so active, and you, the opponent might run into it, you know? Okay, loads of great health to heal for Fan here. Yep, yeah, and there it is, right? That miss coming through, and that's going to be the round. Just like that. Round three. Fight. It's clean with it. Absolutely. With the miss. Double miss. I'm going to double it up on that. Have two doses. Oosh. Spins away. Flint has been very consistent at that to get out of situations and the down forward two to get the balcony bake. We're going downstairs and the round. Oh wow! I thought that would kill. Just the magic pixel, but that does though. Yeah. Good dark, and that's going to be the launch from Flan. Going to be taking it to the wall, but that is not the wall blast side. Bit more patience from Fan, knowing that the mist can come out at any time from Schizophrenic now. 
flash coming through to the wall. And that's the wall blast. Oh yeah, there we go. Big damage here from Than. Oh, yeah. That is two to two. Okay, this Jack pick kind of working out here. Yes, two to two. The flash though, gonna come out. The engager. Good spin away. Spin away again, and that's gonna pick up a punish that time. Flash gonna heal up some health. Oh, drops it! Yeah, punk convert to the wall. Was trying to get an extra jab in there. Okay, spins away. And that was well done from Than, picking up game number one in the grand finals. And is now counter locked into Jack. So the Jack right doing a lot of work here, and uh, that might be the key that he's been looking for. So long. Yes. Very, very interesting here. Yeah, I mean, exciting times and now schizophrenic. Just gonna take a second in the lobby. You know, always good to take a second, as always, as per uh, TWT balls. You do get a minute in between games to, you know, uh, get some coaching or think about your next move, so. Always useful to take that minute anyway, whether you win or lose. Unless you're a momentum based player, of course, in which case you want to go straight back into it. Not get iced out. Yeah. Get ready for the next battle. But into the stratosphere we go for game number two. Round one. Fight. Very interesting here, and oh, the immediately miss. with the bad breath, frame one. Yeah. How does that even affect a robot? I don't know. Besides some, the circuit. Somebody installed smell detectors in Jack. Like, <laughs> what's going on? Yeah. Smell vision, though. Smell vision. Round two. Fight. Okay. The mist again coming through. And again. Really trying to catch it. Okay, and again, gonna triple up on that. Okay. I had some really bad fish this morning, you're gonna smell it. Okay. Yep, that's gonna be it with a perfect. And now, Fan, evening up the score line. One to one. And that's gonna be the mist again, picking it up. Ah, uh, the flash. To the wall we go. Big damage. And the setup on Oki. Spins away. Heat smash. Yep, that's gonna be the round, I think. Oh no, okay, doesn't kill. Magic Pixel again. And the low check will be picking that one up. So, uh, game Fight. point here. Rainbow drop. Tech. Yeah. Trying to get the floor blast immediately to take it away from Jack, who is very good with a floor blast. Oh, yeah. There we go. That's to the wall we go. Uh. Okay. Still in the heat. Activates the heat smash. That's going to be a solid amount of damage. That Can't get anything off. off the side wall slump. Yeah, the angle is a bit too awkward, right? Another rainbow drop is teched. And here we go, the pressure. This Be time, though, counter be... hit. Ah. Now it's just Lennox evening up the scoreboard to one to one. That was a great counter hit grab, and that would end off the round and the game. Now, Than with the option to uh, cap to switch here was locked to the jack after winning game one, but now after that loss is allowed to switch. Right. 
Damn, so maybe we are gonna see that Leo after all, right? Yeah, <laughs> maybe, maybe. I mean, it just changes the timing, right? Yeah. So... Get ready for the next and it will round. be, you're completely right, it will be the Leo. All four characters now shown against Schizophrenic over the course of this tournament. Yeah, we're gonna go Le to Paris. the... I think this stage might also be pretty decent for Leo. I guess it's yes. good for Yoshi as well. This is like the prime Mickey Mouse stage, I think. Right? Like, yeah, absolutely. It's so yeah. crazy with those four wall explosions. Here well, we go. That's gonna be yeah. one of them. Bugs Bunny looking up from above. Mixing. Huh. Alright, that's uh, 1-0 now, oh and again! Oh my goodness me, the mist! And that's going to be another war blast as well. Yeah. And, uh, uh, now we only have the two awkward ones left even. Oh, okay. Oh. Getting to get something fancy. Yeah. Whiffs. Smash, but the down forward two. Going to pick up the combo anyways. Oh my god. Days. Schizophrenic is on it now. Two rounds in a row. The check coming through. Yeah, it's not looking good this Leo right now. A second. Ooh, but maybe Let's now. Yeah. The cast cast, the classic. But the flash coming through. Let's to the wall. Not Gonna get the wall one. blast. Third one. Continue the pressure. Yeah. Let's get plus frames into plus frames, baby. Okay. The mist. Do not get hit by one of those. You will lose the game at this health. Yeah. But you know, no heat available and Fran with the heat activation. Nah, no that's way. not gonna work. Yeah, no way. Bit of a desperate action there. And uh, yeah, Fran needs to take that. You know, thank you very much. Free win. Sure. I'll take that. Now Than needs to push the momentum off of that win, if at all possible. Yeah. Looking good. Okay. 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 The more we go, big damage, and it will be the round, and it is looking good. Final round. Okay, Fran's saying, you know, okay, now that we got all the Mickey Mouse stuff out the way, I can play. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But it could be another one at this angle, to be fair. Okay. No! Oh no, the mist! Runs into it. Here we are, the wall, big damage, and the chip. Bring There's the, the grab. Yeah, tagged. Another Grant, one tagged. Get off yeah. of me! Yeah, I mean, that's smart, right? Kind of changing sides there. Getting Grant close yeah. to the wall. Got two blocked. Okay, wait a second. Okay. This could be start or something. Heat activation. And two. Good Blocks break. Regular throw. Break. Oh, that's not with the rainbow oh. drop doesn't get broken! After breaking three in a row, yep. doesn't break the most important one, the last one. Two, and one, lead. It's a Mickey Mouse stage because it has way too many of the silly gimmicks. It's called, that makes it a Mickey Mouse stage. Yeah, it's Common the knowledge. Cartoons. Yeah. Everyone knows this pretty much. Yeah, I, I, I learned this uh, recently <laughs> from you from yourself. <laughs> but we will be going into game number four now, Schizophrenic. One game away from taking the entire tournament. Three rounds away from taking the entire tournament. Fan, two games in a row needed to reset the bracket now. And it will be a switch to the Alyssa. Yeah, so it's in the end the Alyssa, right? The main... Coming out yeah. here and uh. Fight. Do you remember if Schizophrenic does win? Uh, sorry, if uh, Fan does win this game, they will be character locked to the lesser. They will, yeah, for one game. Yeah, for one game. Until the reset, of course. Oh, nicely done there from Fan. That's gonna be a combo off the sidewall. Big splat here. And the low, 
Yeah. Just changing the timing consistently with all these character swaps has got to have schizophrenic with an overloaded mental stack, right? Absolutely. Chainsaws out. Speaking of Mickey Mouse stages, this is a bit of one as well, you know. The small yeah, breaks. Small Not break. as bad as the other ones. I feel like with certain characters really like it, others don't care as much. And there oh, we man. go. The flash kick. Picking up the round there. We last time we saw the Elisa, right? The fan wasn't able to do much damage, but here it's looking quite a bit different. Oh man, this could be a no round round for Fan right here. It's looking really good. This combo gonna kill by going downstairs, and it is a no round round. Yep, and a fast one at that. Like that. Damn. Yes, absolutely. Which means we're going to game number five for our first set in grand finals. Schizophrenic to take this game and win the entire tournament, or Than to take this game and reset the bracket here. Yep. Let's okay. find out. Uh, Alistair's weakness is, I guess, poor, poor damage, especially at the wall. Like, her wall combos are, like, legitimately ass. Might be the worst ones in the game. And with Than going to, uh, like, if Than does get to Wanted by getting a bracket reset and winning the tournament, that will be the first non-Azu, non-Yoshi uh, coming to, uh, the next battle. coming to uh, Wanted from uh, Salty EU, I think. Am yep. I correct? Yeah? Yeah. Round one. Fight. Ooh, tries for a big launch on round start, but Schizophrenic backdash ready, forces the whiff, and that's going to be a big combo. Yeah, I always kind of set. I wonder if that's a combo drop or a setup. I, feel like it, I think it's a setup. It just doesn't do that much damage, <laughs> it's the thing, right? I don't feel like yeah. it's. For me, it probably is worth it. But... The hot kick coming through. It probably does more damage than the Ender because it's unscaled, right? Yeah, I assume so. A little bit of life left. Back. Ooh. Oh no. Yeah, that's going to be the round. Fan. Round two. Uh, Ohara got second place, uh, number one. Yeah. Okay, the mess coming through. That's what I'm saying. Built their robots weird. They did build all the robots weird. But again, dropping the combo. Dr. Buskanovich going like, oh yes, that's a vital feature. Well, if you are trying to make Alyssa a human, then yeah, I guess so. Right. That's true. But the flash combo coming through now. Oh, oh my man. god, look at the damage! Ooh. And the load to take it, very nice. No more man just going installing like sniffer.exe. Yeah. Love it. New, new update needed. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, exactly. There are law specific moves like in certain characters. So. Yeah. Again. Ooh. That's going to catch this time. Delayed it a bit while Than was running forward. Oh, I see. It's an unblockable on on get up. Okay. It's a guard break on get up. Yeah. So that's that's the setup. Oh, the launch! No wow. No it. combo. Yeah, it looks like it was maybe off axis or something. Okay, destruction mode spins away, but still gets caught. The flash doesn't connect. Mist doesn't connect. Just movement now. Eight seconds left on the clock. Really needs to get something, but the float is going to burn more of the timer. Yep, that's going to be Fran right. now in the lead. Time up. Round four. Fight. Okay. Sweeps. Good dot from Fan, avoiding the high and getting the combo there. Okay, good dot. They're going to heal up healing. some health. Man's well, meditation mode. Oh, yeah, 
that you can kind of see Fran, you know, being at points just a bit more patient than just waiting outside of that poison breath range. Yeah, and that's going to be a bracket reset hey. for Fran. And I feel like that might be really bad here for Schizophrenic, is what I'm feeling. Because it feels like Fran now has all the momentum. Yes, on his side. And that's going to be. Hmm. And people are mentioning in the chat that Dick Jab Float was uh, imperative as well. Yep. Uh, uh, uh. But now Fan able to go to any character they want to, as it is a completely new set. True. I think you probably want to stay on the character. On the Alyssa, yeah. Won, right? <laughs> yeah, of course, yeah. But at the very least, does have the option if need be. True. It's going to be interesting regardless. Well, that is two games in a row for Than there. And we are going to Arena Underground, and Than will be sticking to the Alyssa. Here we go. Okay. Destruction mode coming out. The chainsaws get stopped by the low. The mist coming out multiple times, but a great engage from Than. Than on the timing is going to get some hits in. Okay, spinning away now, the mist. Yeah, just Than playing outside of that mist range, being patient. Going to be the low chainsaws picking up the round. Gonna be the heat engager now. And again. Oh, the hot kick. Yeah. It's gonna be big and it's gonna be through the wall blast as well. Oh no, just okay. off the side. Oh, yes, it will be. There we go. Okay. Nice. Yeah, two rounds straight again. Fran. Just uh, all gold splits right now. Speed running yes. this first match. Gonna set up the bad breath. Can't get any of that. The flash gonna whip as well. Okay, down for two. What a hard call out as well after the chainsaws. Yeah, <laughs> absolutely. To the wall we go. Wall blast. Those are the cartoons. Heat blast. Gonna stop any defensive options coming out there. Smash coming through. So stepping away, this is gonna be a big punch. Back turn, grab. Very, very nice and generic down four there. Okay. A second. Coming through now. No wall blast on this side. Oh my! Okay. Oh, okay. Doesn't get the knockdown. The perfect still comes through though. And that's going to be game number one of the reset to Fran. Fran, got a mid looking really, really solid right now. Mm -hmm. Is now, of course, character locked to the Alyssa. And yep. we know Schizophrenic won't be switching. Yeah, absolutely not. Interesting here. Right. Schizophrenic, I think, needs to stop relying on uh, the mist so much, actually, because Flan has adjusted and is now playing around yeah. that range. Absolutely. Yeah, it's um, especially yeah, you know, Alyssa, one of I should say one of the best moving characters in the game. Right, you have such mm. good movement and. It feels like Fran is just kind of baiting it out at this point. Um, yeah, it's really great mobility from uh, Alyssa. Of course, but the bad breath does connect that time. Which unfortunately reinforces the idea in Schizophrenic's mind that it's it's still good, right? I mean, it is still good, you just good, yeah, have to I use mean, it like, more sparingly, maybe. Perfectly, yeah. But that's going to be a perfect round 
some schizophrenic, just pressure on pressure on pressure, and that's how you need to play Tekken 8. Second, right? This B okay. start of something very interesting here. Down forward two, gonna pick up the combo here. It's gonna send to the wall as well. Oh, nice jab pressure to get the extra damage at the wall and the setup as well off of knockdown. And the heat smash gonna be picking up the round again. Schizophrenic really picking up now. And you can see in round two, didn't use a single bad breath. Adjustment made. Let's see if it works out. The floor blast cartoon taken away. Okay, wait a second. Yeah, I'm not having it. He's saying you got yeah. a chainsaw, well I got a sword. Yes, to the wall we go. Eat fast. Still very useful here. Good setup there on knockdown from Than. Oh, we're just whipping Ooh. right now, both players. Yep. Exhaustion, baby. Still has heat, but gets caught, loses it. Good grab break. The low, gonna be picking up the round there. Ducks under the mist, can't get anything off of it though. The pookie knee. Yeah. Ooh, Heat Bass doesn't connect, so Than has a chance to fight out the wall here and does so. Oh, Than with a Heat Smash after seeing the whiff is going to be picking up that round. And this could be a reverse no round round here. Yeah, and that would be awful if he's catch running right, because that means you go down 2 0 after already losing two straight there in the. Uh, ooh. In the good side of the grand final, right? Now you're in the reset, yep. and potentially you're gonna have to win three in a row. Yeah, absolutely. And now. Oh, wait a second. Down forward two. Coming in yeah. clutch. A lot of the health healed up as well. Yep. Oh, that could be it. Yes, it sir. Will it will rage hard. And that is one to one. Yeah, keep it simple there from Schizophrenic. Good job. Make sure that round is confirmed and it's one apiece. Yeah, what a comeback as well, man. So, so good. And that's it. What we just saw here with Yoshi, right? That's another strength of his. Is, um, he goes into a uh, heat and uh, he activates. He takes the green up. He uh, drinks his Estus flask. You know, look, look. Doesn't matter. His health just says, you know, he just gets it all back so easily. Yeah, of course. Yeah. Yeah. Right. So we are still alive, we're still alive, we're still good. Who's going to yes. take it here? Absolutely. Than does have the option to switch characters, of course, but I think we'll be staying with Alessa for the rest Get of the set. Ready yeah. for the next yes. battle. Into Yakushima. And remember that uh, Than did win on this stage last time. Bad breath. Slidey gets blocked and punished correctly from Schizophrenic. Good job there. The flash combo. Flying away now. Low check coming through. The grab next. Goes unbroken there. And now the heat engager. Shoshimitsu doesn't have heat and all this destruction mode multi-hits are taking so much chip damage away from Schizophrenic. Round. It's going to be Than picking up the first round. Fight. Okay, low check under the mist. And again, throwing out the mist maybe a little bit too often. Than just playing around it well and the flash doesn't connect either. Oh, tries to sidestep, but the miss still catches there. Oh, pa power crashes through with the jet boosters. 
go the and lows. again that low ride doing so much work here for Fran now up two to zero Absolutely. now big launch for Fran and gets the sap as well on lockdown slidey coming through for some extra damage as well rainbow drop broken Ooh. okay that could be a perfect away it's a miracle here. Heat activation just to drop it in. Ooh, look at the chip. Oh, but the flash comes through. Good job. Some get some Planet there. Gonna heal back up some health, but it's not too much. Yeah, it's not gonna Still do much, right? You, you have yeah. like one float away and that is gonna yeah. do it. Two, two, one. Rap. Okay, trying to book Fan. a uh, Spot and wanted here. And, uh, yeah. Very, very close to doing so. Yeah, one game away now and is locked into the Alyssa. Imagine if it goes 2 2 and Flan switches on last game. <laughs> no way. <laughs> no, no way that happens. But it would be a dummy mix up. <laughs> it would. But yes, into game number four of the the grand finals reset now. We are getting ready to go into it. Into the stratosphere we will go. Let's see. We're gonna have double Luigi here. Will yes. France just end it all? Good low blocks coming out now, and that's gonna be the launcher. First launcher of game number four here. That's gonna be a lot of damage, even the, even with Alyssa's bad wall damage there. The engager. Okay. Ooh, nice. Good block there. Good punish and a good punish. Still in heat. Yeah, but just but kind of check. spending it on whiffing two moves right and uh, Yeah. Yeah. Fight. In the price. And the launch again, same launch on round start as last time for Than. It's looking dangerous. Good low block, that's a full launch, a full punch, and a full combo. No checks coming through again. The trade gonna be in favor of Schizophrenic. To the wall we go. Burst cancel. Good blocking there. Chip does a little bit though. Burst gonna connect. Dash coming no! through. No! No! This like is this. No! Side steps away from it. And that puts Fight. Flan at tournament point. Yeah. Would have been hilarious if that was the final round. Yes, absolutely. I respect it. Right, but... Oh, absolutely. Floor blast here as well. Spring kick, get up. But it gets flashed. The wall again. A bit of trouble because Frenic here can yep. cook something up, but well yeah. do with the heat smash. Floor blast still available. Now forward to okay. Two. Into the wall we go. Okay. Nice Good conversion. I think the heat so fan stays in the corner. That's really good. Big damage here. Side steps away Ooh. and the heat. Smash off Wait of the a second. Rip. What? This kid's playing just playing like a completely different player. Suddenly, maybe a little bit too late though. Yeah, the low block gets a full punish, and the low's coming out again Ooh, for fans. Again. Okay. The flash gets some of the great health back. It's not much, but it's enough. Yeah. The wall here. Time to mix hub kick. Hub kick. Awkward oh, angle though, right? Yeah. Activates heat, and yeah, they. Ooh. That's actually not it. gets a nice combo. But that oh, there will it is. do it. Down forward four from Fran takes it. And that is the first non Yoshimitsu, non Azusena, winning salty EU on the tenth try. Double digits are the charm. And Than will be moving on to Wanted and gaining the majority of that five sport. Absolutely. What a great set, though. Absolutely.
Very, very nicely played there. And if you enjoyed that set, you still have time to claim some codes. There's 12 remaining. 25 cents. Absolutely free money to contribute to the first pool. Please do it now. You know, before it all gets paid out. <laughs> But also yeah, now what with, um, with Fran and Lona being confirmed the same player, I gotta go back to all the tournaments Lona is in, and I gotta re-upload them <laughs> and add <laughs> Fran instead of Loner. Oh, to to the stats sheet. To, yeah, 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 yeah. Otherwise, it's gonna be weird. Because Fran also yes. signed up as Fran before, so it's like a weird yes. mix now. Yeah, GG's. What a good set. GG's. What a good set. Absolutely. Very well played. Thank you everyone again uh, for joining. Mm -hmm. 56 Absolutely. players. Yeah, I can do that. I can do that. That that works out fine. Um It just takes a bit of work, but it's not really like maybe yeah. take ten minutes. <laughs> I'm overplaying yeah. how much work it is, you know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh but yeah. GG's everyone. Very GGs. nice. Uh, again, 56 players. Not bad, not bad. Uh, for 10th tournament, for sure. Sure. Um, obviously, you know, especially, I uh, I hope that uh, once I do my announcement of our interesting tournament that's coming up, uh, that we get, you know, even more players. Yes. Ah, oh, with PS5. Oh, it's like that. It's like a confusion. I see, I see. Yeah. No, it's as long as your Discord has the same name as your Chillanch, it's fine. I don't like yes. it, doesn't matter what your account is called on like PS5 or PC or whatever. It's like, cool. yes, that doesn't matter. It's just like so people can find you. Yeah. Yes, but yeah. But I have anything to, to promote before we head off. Yeah, I guess uh, if you're interested, obviously, we have a YouTube channel. You can find all the nine previous VODs on there. Mm -hmm. um, also, a lot of other games: Guilty Gear Strive, Exerd, Blaze Blue, Street Fighter Six, and so on, so forth. Uh, make sure you join our Discord if you're interested in playing um, any of yes, these games. Absolutely. Obviously, uh, we currently host uh, Guilty Gear Strive on Mondays, Exerd on Tuesdays, and Tekken on Saturdays. Uh, all of them at 7:15 CET. Now soon CEST. That's changing on yes. Monday, so every UK player will get very confused. Um, uh, that wait. will be me. Yeah, I'll wait. <laughs> uh, I'll also be confused. Uh, it's going to be good. Well, how about you, uh, Hakobi? How, yes. Uh... Um, if you want to find me and me doing any fighting game shenanigans, will always, always, always be posted on at Hakobi and Pereira on my Twitter, which you can see down there. Um, I stream sometimes. I stream today, actually. Uh, my The announcement for Eddie Gordo. I obviously play in the Tekken World Tour and I do commentary, so... Anything I do that is fighting game related will always be posted on the Twitter. So feel free to follow that and you'll be updated on literally everything I do. Yeah. Um, yeah, I guess in, in two weeks I'm uh, I'm probably going to or I'm planning to go to install. So yes, you are. I'm, I'm going to go unless something goes horribly wrong. I'll be there. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, oh, actually. Now this is going to work out weird because of how it's set up um mm. this top eight image it's gonna show the week like last week because of something with the name yeah so we're gonna i'm just gonna do like a botch job here one second <laughs> because i have it set up and i have like both downloaded right now there we go i see i see there we go just act like it's i'm not gonna align it just act like it's well aligned <laughs> top eight for tonight we're go. gonna rate uh you know we've we had SF ff from a local now we're gonna rate somebody from a local we're gonna rate uh, sasho she's um a lee player Ooh. yeah uh, the shroop shroop sure flag is there you see it yes is there yeah it's her first stream so be nice oh awesome yeah, yeah. uh no alerts nothing wow yeah so um Go say hi. Yes, go and, say uh, hi. Hope everyone has a nice Saturday evening. Have a good one. Peace out. Bye bye.